Hi. We return. Yeah. It's more, uh... <laughs> I can't even say the name with a straight face. <laughs> Let them eat dick. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. I don't know how... I don't... I can't even say the name. God damn it. <laughs> Let them eat dick. Welcome back. Uh... Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's us again. <laughs> so, yeah, uh... Speaking of the name, we will I, make I, the I, enemy I, worry. <laughs> eat dick. Oh my god. Napoleonic <laughs> oh, D&D. <laughs> Napoleonic D&D with your favorite orc, Napoleon <laughs> Hector <laughs> Gil Sanchez III. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I do love the picture with him. <laughs> picture of him standing in front of a picture of him. <laughs> <laughs> Doing the exact Please. same pose. <laughs> well, it's the bucket. Oh, God. <laughs> yes, it will. It does have such past <laughs> energy. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, would someone like to uh, do a, a quick recap as to what happened? In the last session, it was team leader. You should do this. Uh, so last I... time we tried to sabotage our enemies. Mm -hmm. In multiple yeah, various man. ways. Yeah, he, yeah. Start, he started bullying some hobgoblins. For like, <laughs> suddenly got so aggressive. <laughs> it was very mixed success. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I think everyone did a bunch of little interesting side hustles just, in the city. I don't know why I became aggressive. I can't believe this. <laughs> mm. uh, oh, my book said it says you're a heretic. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. That might story. have been to poison. Vote to the ruler of the city. Um, that mostly didn't go anywhere, really. Um, this was like, I'll let you know. Um, and like the rest of you did some other projects in the city um, we eventually left and we stumbled upon a battle I, I think that recaps it well enough <laughs> like, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. unless there's anything specific you want to mention <laughs> we are about to die salute you <laughs> I, knew I think it's all from the poisoning of the wolves so, no <laughs> you yeah, we poisoned their mounts, which uh, may have had an effect. We're not entirely sure how effective it was. Yeah. I think we were told how effective it was, right? It was mm. like that... 10%. Like like 10 of them wasn't there. Would you like to make mm. a perception check and just look at them over there across the battlefield? Oh yeah, oh, that was also uh, the very uh, different uh, things uh, like... Getting them have sick, a drunk, room. and trying to direct them through the assassin skill. <laughs> I'm right, so um, back and ready. If you have a telescope, you can make your test with the uh, advantage. But yeah, so Stu, you look across the battlefield and you, uh, you just can't see shit because it's just covered in smoke. There's just smoke everywhere. Yeah. You do see a glorious uh, charge by uh, His Holiness the God Emperor. Look at him yeah. over there, looking all chad with his wings and everything. <laughs> yeah. It's an expression oh, of his, his sweet nice hairline. hairline. Yeah. His magnificent hairline. <laughs> his glorious self. Yeah. Okay. Pop out the character sheet on the other screen. <laughs> Not to mention his incredible height. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. He's so big. It's, it's like so glorious. really tall, though. Really yeah. tall. There we go. There's the music again. Yep. Some of your uh, boys are all moving out to go fight. Oh, including the... Uh, the Rio Dawn uh, Marines, uh, Jaeger Marines, uh, mm. 
Do Ready? I have their marching song? I do. Here it is. Ready for it? Go ahead. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it's the bad Oh no. <laughs> I told you to appreciate the uh, mm. Black Watch <laughs> Band <laughs> leading your, your men to combat too. <laughs> yep, do I have this lord? You know, I love how it overlaps with the rest. Yeah, one of the things that occurred to me while I was like playing with some of the audio for this battle was that how much a lot of the music just overlaps and becomes me, a cacophony of random sound. Nah, I can't hear nothing. <laughs> you probably even turned down. <clears throat> Open volume mixer. Browsers at maximum. It's supposed to be in the jukebox, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I, I see the tracks to... playing, but I don't see a volume. You might need to reload the page if it doesn't load properly. Five. Oh, uh, God damn it! It closed my character sheet. <laughs> Have you considered reloading the page? What's that? Coming? I did. Mister Selfie. Could I possibly take a look through that looking glass? I might be able to give you a view or two. Hmm. Do I have a looking grass, by the way? I'm I don't just know. Not... Do, do you have one? I don't think I do. I think it's. I think. I think she's holding her hands in like a cup. Oh, I, yeah. I think she's kind of looking to her. Uh, let me. Let me. I'll hold my hands up to her hands and then assume a cupping formation. Without <laughs> skipping a beat, hold it up to my eyes and just. Uh, uh, try to get a view of the battlefield. Could I do pass a perception check or mm -hmm. uh, pass a perception of nineteen? What do I see? Or do you want me to roll? Oh, pass a perception nineteen. Sorry, I was uh, I just seen Bill, Bill's message. Um, you noticed that the. Uh, you looking at the battle in general, or are you trying to specifically find out about that one regiment? Um, in the battle in general, and that one regiment. Yeah, one second. Or should I do an active perception roll? Uh, do one active perception perception roll, but I'm going to give you a bonus on top of it. Sorry, I'm just going to respond to roll. Oh, uh, I just rolled you see fucking everything. <laughs> yeah, you you notice that everyone is kind of like looking at the battle from like a, you know from the ground level and you realize if you uh take a, a like a, get a boost up onto the parapet you can kind of look over and see a uh slightly higher from a higher elevation and uh you get to see some cool stuff i'll uh, tell you in a moment I, uh, I turn on free camera while we're playing this fucking battle <laughs> yeah i mean i do have a visible mage hand and a spider familiar i can do something with that <laughs> So, yeah. You know what? You see that the boys over here are like a mixture of uh, what appear to be uh, household troops of uh, Sanchez family. You also see a number of uh, more of the guys with the, the house on symbol, including. Uh, that guy you met, Lieutenant Lieutenant Mundruck, he's over there with some some boys. Except he's not with fifty of them. He's with about like thirty, thirty-five, mm, ah. about. Uh, he seems 40%. to be have depleted his numbers by quite a few. Thirty percent. Maybe you, you mentioned last episode that they were in poor-looking shape as well. Is that also the case? Some of his guys that are not mounted are covered in mud. <laughs> hmm. Nice. Mud, mud, an obvious sign of weakness. Uh, it looks like they took face took face first into the mud. You also see in the distance, far over there, you see some uh, ankylosaurs with uh, heavy, uh, heavy armor on them and some uh, mounted lizard men. In the distance, they look awful like Sinbu. It's a different color. Mm. And a uh, individual in the distance. No, oh dear. Oh god. She should be at the Super Bowl today. <laughs> yeah, she should be, but she's here instead. <laughs> she's had a busy day. 
Fuck off. Back to Las Vegas. That, that was uh, input from Ritualist. He, he wanted uh, Taylor Sniff, the great great the granddaughter of Catahan, Cadbury, to be the general of the uh, Australian Armed Forces. <laughs> Our expeditionary That's force. So yeah. Taylor the Swift. Yeah, it's nice. Has yeah, she good. also inherited the musculature of that fucking abomination? Uh, somewhat. Oh, damn. It's the uniform, it, uh, you, you can't quite tell. It's, uh, it's, it's a good fit. Um, That's blended pretty well, actually, I'm not gonna yeah. lie. You do notice something. As you see, they your heavy infantry and the god emperor leading a cavalry charge captain against uh, some uh, enemy line infantry you notice that there is a uh, there is a portion of the enemy position that appears to be less well protected off to the far left and if you were to take a moment to look around and see what's going on you also notice that uh, a badger man over here is uh, collecting uh, some kobolds together along with uh, the rest of your party who are taking interest in what they're doing. You might want to uh, give them some information about a uh, opening in the uh, end line. Alright, well, I'm going to do a little something. I'm going to give him a second. I'm going to use a spell Thalenturgy. Um, but instead of booming my voice, um, I'm going to change my voice around a bit to sound like I am an exhausted Irish archaeologist and I relay all this to, um, Sylvie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's mean. Oh, no. <laughs> you know what? Let me just swap you to this map. All right. And if I think we go this way and this way, I think we can get you done. Hey, what do you think, Sully? Oh, dear God. <laughs> <You're dumb. laughs> oh, shit. Yep. Yeah. I'd like to join your, your boy over here next to the uh, friendly line. <laughs> Are those pug? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> the pug parts will be Definitely boy. dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I ran out yes. of assets. No. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the the way they're built five by five oh, makes them look fucking Putin winded. Oh the uh <laughs> yeah, th those are the big big cavalry formation and the heavy infantry formation who I ran out of time. Right, where are going. we exactly? This is a huge Over here map. next to the uh the gun line. Uh, he, left or right of the map? <laughs> uh, you'll right. see your friends over here on the far right of the map at the bottom. Far right, yeah. alright. Yeah. Bottom oh. right. Oh yeah, I um, see it now. Um, I think I'm you could gonna... specify heavy, look at the fucking thickness of that light. I'm also gonna volunteer to kinda try and corporal or sergeant for Sylvie, that way, um, with that with that uh, cantrip, I can give out booming commands over a loud fucking battlefield. <laughs> there you Te go. Technically, you are another member of the party who has military experience. That's a lot of guys. That's a lot of fucking guys. Alright, so let's see. We've got us and yeah, six just... brave kobolds and shrews. <laughs> I'm just gonna ping for captain's uh, benefit. Over here is where you notice that there appears to be a lot less going on. Uh, also, there's a lot of uh, cover <laughs> and rough ground that you can uh, stealth your way in if you wanted to uh, take advantage of an opening in the line there. You moved the screen while I was grabbing the token. The just the the <laughs> he was scouting. <laughs> Running away from enemy artillery fire. Seems to be like we have an opening, sir. Oh, indeed. Um, I'll relay the my idea to. I don't know. I just beat the drum. And to Chubri, but um, if us and the Kobolds, we can literally just <laughs> go through the woods and just stealth all the way up. 
That's what I want to do, yeah. And then just fuck up their cannons, oh. and that honestly should mm -hmm. swing things What up, What a coincidence. Uh, and I just... join you on this endeavor. Shrewsbury yeah. will say that his commandos are ready <laughs> to do his oh, patrol awesome. jump. The kobold commandos from Kipnixburg and... are here. <laughs> It's up to the other commanders, like Corleone and Sharp, but they should probably just distract the main infantry as they come out. Heck so, yeah. Just to give us a little bit of yeah. a... We well, can at the very least take out their cannons, which should help a lot. Sharp is well, we can redirect their cannons. Guys all lined up in a nice uh, formation. I'm guessing the Emperor and Klaus just have two big blocks of troops as well, that's why they're a big... Yeah, they're in a big, uh, big blob of uh, boys. Play infantry and cav, I guess. Yeah. They are oh, the God. big heavy, heavy hitters. They're going to try and uh, do a full front assault. You know. Mm -hmm. As you do. I like to. I like to support the full front assault. <laughs> By all I'd like to um, go around and ambush the firing lines. I'd um, like to try to inspire the troop. <laughs> um. For Sharp, with a little for all of Sharp's men, um, before they're going off in the battle, could I possibly cast Guidance on all of them uh, with my cantrip? I that way they could. have a police. Probably still have range. They're not slowing down for anyone, but they are uh, within your range. Yeah. Alright. No, with a little mix of Thaumaturgy and uh, casting Guidance. You know what, Eminem is um, in command of the uh, the artillery. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah, hopefully, hopefully that can give him a boost. That's an awfully hot coffee pot. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, by the way, Cross, uh, mm -hmm. just as a, a thing, how many uh, javelins would I have crafted from the bones of that one deer? Um... Roll me a d6. Alright. <laughs> no, Apparently right. just one. <laughs> That's fine. That's said you could have just bought them, but then I remember we're all broke. <laughs> I mean, I could have, but uh, I like making my own stuff. That is fair. That is true. Could have made it from the human skeletons. Nah, the bones were all sun, uh, sun bleached and brittle and stuff. Mm, fair. <clears throat> all right, I need to look up the damage of a javelin. Should have probably done this beforehand. <laughs> Also, on a side note, yeah? do any of our characters know how to operate cannons? <laughs> do you have a... Uh, 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 what's it called? Proficiency with uh, artillery? 1d6, alrighty. Nope. So unfortunate. Nope, then no. Hmm. I wish Han was here, he'd have proficiency in artillery. <laughs> do you have proficiency with firearms? Uh, yes, with firearms I do. Yeah. I think I think just Stu has proficiency with small arms. Uh, if it's anything like a crossbow, we could try our best. Well, some of the kobolds are armed with crossbows. Ooh. One of them has a pistol. Nice. But uh, he doesn't seem to know what he knows. Look like he knows what he's doing with it as he keeps flagging everyone. Oh, poor guy. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's that. typical kobold logic. Yeah. <laughs> you know what these kobolds are reminding me of? The the little jackals from Halo because they're like skirmishers as well. Glorious. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, okay. The little Something's kobolds wrong. are like uh, just... darkening themselves up with charcoal. <laughs> <laughs> they're wearing little beanies. <laughs> Oh, well, do I do like this again? Mini dragons, is that kind of their vibe or whatever? Uh, I can yeah. Make it pop a bigger. Yeah. Uh, here you go. There you go. Oh, yeah. yeah. Little Ooh. dragon worshippers yeah. from Kiplingsburg. Yeah. 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 Do the finish. Train in the art of war. 
Mm. Apparently. <laughs> By who? <laughs> who knows? It's Kiplingsburg. It's the, yeah, I was about to say, they the came from the Empire go there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Their concept of rules of war is cause chaos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, kinda. Sneaky, conniving little bastards. Mm -hmm. Well, that's part of war. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're exactly what we need right now, to be honest. I mean, as long as we don't get them, like, sad saying, gee, I go home. We should <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> uh. well, you're not general I infantry, think... though. <laughs> yeah, this yeah if, if anyone's doing that, it's the elves aren't with muskets next to Sharp. Oh, those are light infantry. <laughs> <laughs> Go home, light infantry. <laughs> Go home, ally. <laughs> oh, I mean, if anyone was saying that, it would be them. Um, <laughs> I, I was walking around an... the forest, and an elf shot me in the face with a gun. <laughs> I I have another idea. Um, if we capture any powder. We could possibly try to lure some people in and then detonate it. Mm. Or use it as a big, or set off a big explosion and use it as a big distraction. We could load up a kobold in the, the artillery and shoot him <laughs> in the back lines to blow up their. The human cannon. <laughs> their fire. Oh, sir, <laughs> sir, sir, Kipling, uh, sir uh, I forget his first name. Sir Shoot. Maybe not the one with the gun. We'll point out that uh, if you feel like you can uh, take that uh, gun position, that might be very helpful. Uh, which one? The the one directly. Hang on, I'm just typing something. Uh, I do see three of them. One. Yeah, it feels like if you can uh, take a gun position, you'd have a, a nice foothold. Oh yeah, true. In the enemy. Then nice. They can put reinforcements in. Yeah, especially when it's not not as well guarded as the rest of the camp. Oh, those are trees on the bottom. Yeah. I thought those were craters from uh, artillery well, or mines. A little mines. bit of a wood, yeah. yeah. A little bit yeah, of a wood, a... and there's some uh, raised ground as well. Just... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah, right. I'm That's assuming... what I'm going to do. I'm going to go around like the south and try to sneak in behind their firing, li firing mm -hmm. lines. And Okay, so I would say this is normal ground. This is raised ground. That's lowered ground. You see oh, these, you, uh, can, uh, you can see like shadows, right? Shadow from the raised ground. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I'm I'm going to more towards the uh, the ones that look like bushes and the ones that look like divots. Mm -hmm. Like Hope these. So it's some nice uh, grass. I don't know. Can you see Field mm -hmm. Marshal Carleon there on the uh, on the uh, turn order? He, he's thing? at the mastery. Uh, you can yes, see, yeah, I can, can see, see him. On the turn him. order. Yeah. Cool. Yep. And, uh, Do we roll in shit general or... over here? Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> it's your boy. Yeah. <laughs> he should be known as General for the moment. Oh, damn it's Will. Oh my god. It's general Will. He's here. Oh, we are rolling initiative. Fuck Will Helm. Send for a bitch. Nice! Bitch. Did I remember to do Field Martian uh, Carly Owens character sheet? No, I did not. <laughs> no. I'm sure you can just copy something for the I'm Field just going to roll a D100. <laughs> no, sorry, a D20. Oh, I keep forgetting the system. God damn it. Yeah. He, he gets a 5. And then Big Will will get his D20 roll. He gets a 15. Alright. Uh, hey Cross. Yeah. Uh, maybe probably you probably just remember that rule and remove it because if you actually do select one, the turn order it shows where he is. Where he is in the map. Like, if I select turn oil, it outlines him. That's what I mean. Yeah, you can see where he is, but like, still, okay. it's not gonna, it's not too much of a surprise. Like, there's a tent on the hill over there, you can kinda guess he's there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just, I, yeah my bad. Yeah. If you had a telescope, you might be able to see him. 
How much was that telescope? Wasn't it like a hundred gold or something? It's a thousand gold, I think. I, I... <laughs> oh, that, that's yeah. pricey. We should have just stopped. Yeah, they're pretty fucking <laughs> oh, pricey. Alright. Do you wish to begin? Tomorian is ready. We never command her. Alright. You know what? The uh, boys and Boo song. should go before you me. You all ready? You all hype? I, I rolled a five. Yeah, but you have an initial bonus of three. Uh, the person with the higher initiative bonus goes first. You're all right. <laughs> but shouldn't Elijah go first since you're old 20? Yeah, Elijah. Yeah, no, no, I mean before me. Oh, you yeah. To go first, Elijah. Gobo's yes, just singing you a song while you're waiting. <laughs> I'm supposed to sing you a song. Fair enough. He'll, he'll join in. Yeah. Those kobolds have nice vocals. <laughs> yeah. Why not? <laughs> you join me. boost morale. <laughs> yeah, I think mainly just what, what Elijah's gonna do now. Yeah? Gonna, gonna join in on the... Let's try to build morale. Song. Joining in the You're gonna go on the stealth the mission and song. as they start singing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man. Suppose I could move a bit over. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Yeah. Is that your turn? Build some morale. That's yeah. me. Hi. Alright. So. The boys. The enemies. We're going to start moving out of the fortification and get re ready for round 20 of battle. <laughs> yeah, some more guys are coming out. Some familiar faces. Those are tents, not the guys. <laughs> oh no. The it's tents familiar, begin to familiar march faces to war. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, so moving out as well. All right. Turn the tents to the siege engines. Fuck <laughs> the boys. All right. Oh, the least. What are you doing? Uh, I'll begin to uh, get ready, check everything, and I'll just say to my three servants, uh, if I happen to die, um, just tell my dad I did well. Okay? Can you get back to Feywood? All right. <laughs> they give you a thumbs up. <laughs> yeah. All right. I did all right. You know. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Let's begin. <coughs> to war! Just start to yeah. creep off into the bushes. I'd like to make Let's a spell go. test as you are sleeping in the yep. forest. See if anyone notices you. Let's see if anyone notices you. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Oh yeah, you slip in. It's your, your elvishness is kind of... Do I get an advantage, actually, for the cloak? Or whatever it is. Nice. Uh oh, you have a cloak. The leaf armor what? counts the cloak, doesn't it? Well, there's a specific cloak of elven kind that gives you a, a, an oh, advantage. Okay. I think this is what you're thinking of. I accidentally, Me. accidentally closed the wrong one. I do have a thing for it. Oh yeah, yeah Mask of the Wild. That was it. Oh, Mask of the Wild. Yeah, oh, that just means I can hide while there's like smoke and all yeah. their weird bullshit. Yeah. You know what? This battle is perfect for that, for your Elwood Elfishness, because you can, you're basically invisible. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Alright. I, I think. I'll just move 30 for now, just to yeah. see if people catch up, because yeah. if I go too far, that can be a problem. Yep, cool. leave it up. Alright, uh, Captain. Hey. Boys are moving out. Well, I wish I had time for a sermon. But now is the time to do God's work with our hands. Alright, the boys. Let's show them the way to head. Uh, I will do my best to kind of run up and. I'm gonna do a 
Do a double move. Yeah. Do a double move. Yep. No worries. Can you do a stealth test as you slip into the woods to see if anyone notices you? Uh, you with 10 dexterity. Or 11. Shout what your result is. Um. 14. 14. Um. I don't know why I rolled toys. It might have. Sometimes it. Oh. I think you might have it set to um, a disadvantage, it looks like. You can ignore it. That's fine. Is this advantage okay. for the heavy armor? Ah, uh, okay. Oh, because of stealth, I see. Okay. Yeah. Never mind, that's fine. Alright then. Um. I don't know how it knew that. Cool. Um. Is that your turn? Yes. Well, um, if I double move, do I still have a, st a standard action? Or, well... Uh, that, that is your standard action. Your, uh, for going. Alright, never mind. Do a double move, yeah. Alright, so, uh... Gehildred. Gehildred. Uh... Okay, if Sambu goes before me. Right, well, then I'm going to slip into the woods as well. Yeah. Do a stealth check, I guess. Actually, no, because there's high ground in front of me, so they can't see me. Uh, so I will make a dash. Uh, how do I, do I press spacebar to see uh, the distance? I can't remember. How, how did you do that? Uh, I need to there's a local it. ruler icon on the left. Yeah, yeah ruler tool. Uh, so the ruler. Dice. To be on the sidebar. All right, so I'll make like. You can also right click to do angles yeah. and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Thirty-five. About. Oh uh, wait, what's my land speed? Thirty. So it's uh, sixty. I'll yeah. run here. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Oop. Can you make a stealth test to see if you're noticed? I'm a far away. I laser. mean, there's there's high ground in front of me, but sure. I think it was here, right? Well, you might be getting a super secret bonus on top. Stealth. Alright. Alright, uh. And that's my turn. Yeah. Did you say you wanted to swap around Warmick in the turn order? Yeah, yeah, because, yeah, uh. Yeah. There he has the. Alright. Uh, dex bonus, that's yeah. why. Uh. Fuck. I don't know if I should go with my team or if I should stick with the main force. I don't know which one's going to be more useful. Because if I fuck up the stealth, that's just going to alert everyone. I mean, I don't know if you're going to alert anybody via sound because there's like cannon yeah, fire that's, and that's stuff, true. right? Mm -hmm. Alright, hold on. I think I'll go with Sharp's group. Hello? There you go. Yeah. Provide a nice space of fire for us, that's cool. But I'll stick yeah. with you then, so we don't get fully separated. <laughs> Alright, so that spot. Shit. Fifteen, twenty. 25, 30, 35, 40, 56. Alright. Is that you? Yeah. Cool. It's time turn for your, your friendly boys to uh, start moving. As they uh, advance. Cannons begin opening up and give you some nice cover from all the smoke that they're <laughs> casting off. Let me check what's the range on a cannon. 
<laughs> Should be in front of me, but I don't see it. 200 yards. And I'm picturing it's like 200 meters or something. <laughs> oh, it's not on this page, so it's. I know it's here in the book somewhere. I just don't see it. Mm -hmm. Well, they begin firing. Boom. There's a, a deafening sound. Your ears begin ringing a little bit. And uh, the cobalt uh, starts slipping into the forest. I'm gonna make a stealth check for them. <laughs> oh, bro. That is, that is an hope, Goblin. <laughs> a cobalt should have a higher dex bonus than that. You're right. I, ri I rolled the wrong sheet. <laughs> that was a good catch, Warbeck. <laughs> I was that scared. Again. There hey. we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Yeah, that's the humble list. Oh, yeah. nice! I used the wrong sheet. He, 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 he uh... Scared for my life. He caught that. That was good. That was a good catch. <laughs> Make a large-ass fucking jackal screech. Yep. Elijah, the guy is getting moving off. Yes, sir. What do you do? Uh, you know, I'll head on over as well. I'm gonna dash after Kildred. You gonna join the mage? Okay. Indeed. Okay. Yeah, we'll do it like that. And realizing he has a spooky mask on him, he's gonna th think, "Hey, this might be a war mask or something." Can I roll history to see if I know what the heck the spooky mask is? Go so, ahead. From knowing that you stole them. Did I ever tell you what the spooky mask did? I can't remember. Okay. He's gonna put it on, <laughs> thinking it's a war mask. Oh shit. That people use in war or something. <laughs> that probably makes you really cool. At least looking really cool in right. war. You gotta just wear the mask, I see. You know what? Can you give yourself a little. And uh, I suppose that's the logic. Icon? Yeah, little, it's just gonna put a little spooky mask icon. This, you know is, gonna this is gonna get really. This is gonna get really Jim Carrey real fast. <laughs> <laughs> I, I actually don't have an image of the. Uh, I don't have an image for the uh, the spooky snake mask, but you've you've donned the the snake mask. I see. Word of God, it's okay. turned green right now. I'm leaving the company. You know what, Warbeck? You kind of look over his shoulder. There's a spooky man behind you. All right. Oh God. Where did you come from? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the cannons begin opening up on your boys. Oh dear. Yeah. Couple of couple of rounds. See the hit. They're uh, pretty, pretty close. Low. They land right in front of the God Emperor as he begins his charge. Oh, the enemy. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'll release. <laughs> All right, it's so time to the... double time it. I think. Yeah. Uh, try and there. I'll make a stealth check. That though. Uh, are you kind of looking out as to what's going on, or are you just kind of just focusing on staying quiet? Um, it, like as much as I can do, but I'm mostly just focused on speed as a deck. Okay, the that's fine. So, yep. I'm trying to be somewhat stealthy as I do it. All right. Okay. okay. There you go. I, I'm going to be giving you a secret bonus on top because of uh, you know, dense one, leather one, not. Yeah, like I'm trying to hide as deep in the woodlands as I mm -hmm. 
realistically can be. All right. So, Captain, how you doing? Second verse, same as the first. Put me on flame so I can put him in curse. We. Uh, double move. Do. Get a, th a th ruler. Right here. And hopefully my stealth roll isn't too bad. Not bad. Yep. That's pretty good. All right. Symbol. Oh, it is my turn again. Yeah. Right. Uh huh. Let's see again. Nine. So this would be thirty-five. And... Let's go here, 60. Now I'm gonna try and be more stealthy, but I, I'm still behind the high ground, so technically they shouldn't see me. So I'm gonna dash over here, and I'm gonna roll stealth again. Mm -hmm. Fingers That's... crossed, man. Oh, not Where? bad. Damn. That's fucking really good. You're invisible in the forest. And that would be my turn. Unless I can try and do a perception to see if there's anything around. Yeah, go ahead. Perception. Just, just do a check here. I want to check something. Uh, oh, perfect. Oh shit! <laughs> uh, Holy shit! Who ordered the meteor with a side of meteor? As you kind of look around in like the forest and whatnot, you notice a head. Oh, to oh be, boy! Uh, some badly hidden people <laughs> in the bushes. What I'm oh. gonna do is uh, do some hand signals towards. Uh, uh, what's his name? LD, uh, you know, the, the Eldasi, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce that. Yeah, it's fine. It's Eldalise. Random name. Eldalise. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna, you know, do the two fingers to the eyes and uh, point towards them. Alright, yeah. I'll do To the tree way. line and uh, try and point, point them out, you know. And that's my turn. And uh, support Mr. Sharp. Alright, I think that'll be closer. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oof. Who, who blocked out? You what? Uh, somebody disconnected. Wasn't me. <laughs> Weird. Just in peace. I think we're still all here. But... Alright. Let me see it. <laughs> I will move <laughs> 30 I'll feet. I've dropped out. I think it was so yeah, much. It's, yeah, it's probably what it is. I will go 30 feet towards Sharp and try to contact her, I guess. Um. Excuse me, I I will support you. I will go. Very good. <laughs> let's, All let's, right. Uh, let's kill some bastards. I'll think with the use of my. No, hold on. Can I use an action to control something instead of a bonus action when that's available? Uh, what what do you mean? 
Uh, cause hold on, let me let me read it up real quick first. All right, so Mage Hand is. Uh... Oh, I can use your action to control the hand. Okay. Combined with. Because I should still have my familiar out. Since I, I summoned that, like, the beginning yeah. of the day. He's in your pocket. He's just sitting there, like, all happy, cozy. Yeah. Alright. Oh! Rolls its, own, rolls its own initiative and acts on its own. Got it. Yeah. So I would, with an action, use the mage hand to bring my familiar 30 feet away from me and mm -hmm. try to put it with the uh, other group. Do you want to put them down or will I, do I need to do something? I don't have a token for that. Oh, hang on. Do you just need to chuck something down? Yeah, the, uh, the, the image. spider, yeah? Yeah. Okay, I typed it up here and give me a sec to catch up. Oh my god, come on. More long with spells. You know what? Uh, uh there you go. That's the wrong way. Have to scroll a long way up, damn it. Yep, that's a one. Let me give you the ability to control him. There you go. Where'd you want him? Uh. Oh. I would say. Mage Hand would put him. How far away from me? They're 30 feet out, because that'd be the amount oh, of movement space, so. Yeah. yeah, about there. There you go. And on its own movement would be going with the other side of the group. Mm -hmm. And how far am I away from? Hold on. Fuck. Where is the measure tool? There it is. Ooh, that's within range. All right. Now wait. I don't think it is. I'm sorry, Kalashar rules. I'm gonna try speaking to someone telepathically. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so... Go to core. Mind link. 60 feet of you. Can't reach that. Mm -hmm. Son of a bitch. Oof. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, that, that'll probably be my turn then. And whatever, uh, fucking, hold on, whatever initiative the spider would have. Do you want to roll that, it or is it, do you want to just go on your one? Uh, I'll, I'll roll my own initiative. Okay. And that, that will take for it. Given modifiers, because it's Fey, right? Damn it. Pull it up. My character, she's not working. I don't know. Uh, do you want to just roll a d20 and then add its modifier mod manually? Ah, uh, yeah, that's that's simple. Yeah. There you go. <clears throat> Ten. What's it? Ten. Does it have a dex bonus? Uh. I. I think it's supposed to have the stats of a fey. That's what it said on the uh, uh I don't have my that familiar time. spell. All right, it, it should it'll probably just be ten. Ten is fine. Ten is fine. Okay. All right. I don't know why my my fucking sheet's not loading. All right. Oh, I got it to load. All right. <laughs> it's already been done though. Yeah. That'll be my turn, I think. All right. That's your turn then. It is, uh... uh, actually, sorry. Um, I could use Mold Earth, but I'm good. I already use the spell as well. Mm -hmm. I'm good. All right. <sighs> the 
Mr. Sharp and the boys are going to uh, do a nice little volley because of the boys up north. The cannons are going to keep opening up on the, the boys over here. The, you know, the battle is uh, getting busy. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Going, getting closer to the fight. Oh, All right. Play louder, boys. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Speaking of which, Pasta, it's your turn. Of fallen. <laughs> oh no, uh, there we are. Sorry, I, I think the nap was just messing up. Couldn't hear. Yeah. It, it just trailed off there for a bit. Uh, so, what I'm thinking is out of these fellas, who seems to be be aiming the cans? Out of who? Uh, out of the puggies. Uh, uh, one guy on each cannon is doing it. I, I don't know, past <laughs> general boys using the cannon. Okay, uh... To the ones aiming the cannon. Or at least one of the cannon. I guess. Uh, I have no idea what you on. said. But, um... Okay. G could I give them bot bot okay. inspiration for aiming cans? Yes. Okay. Yep. I would say uh, Mr. Eminem over here is feeling uh, inspired by the bard. <laughs> Excellent. Mr. Eminem. Yeah. That's, that's the dude. Right there. Oh, fuck it, Elf. It's fucking spells. The fuck am I going to use? Um, no, we, we can make it. The real uh, sign shady. Right. Can't you? Uh, I can barely use any spells. Uh, I, I guess. Could I like send a message? I guess. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, sp I suppose I'll send it to Sylvie using my message spell and uh. Basically say, wish you the best, make sure you got a lot of chaos in there. Glorious chaos. Alright. <laughs> Do I just hear this in my head, I guess, like, randomly? Yep. You can You're respond to him, by the way. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. I, I feel good, I guess. <laughs> Alright. Boys are also gonna open up and do another volley. The cannons are gonna plow into the boys. I found out that the range the cannons have is 600 to 2400 feet. <laughs> oh, there you go. No, oh, dear. 12,400? The, unfortunately, in my book, it says. It does a certain amount of damage that is. I think it's 80 10? Jesus Christ. Mm. The, the, the oh, first no. number is actually not printed properly, so I can't see what the fuck it says. Yeah. I think it's an 8. I could be wrong. I'm does in danger. Just, does it just presume Or is there like explosive shells as well? 
Um, it, it literally just says um, D, like some some a certain number, but it's there's a misprint right. here, so I can't see what the number okay. is, which is very helpful. I, I, I would Thanks, just wizards. presume it's probably solid shot. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it's. I think that they they're using solid shot, and I think this is basically a navy <laughs> cannon, so I wouldn't mm, worry yeah, too that much would, about that. Makes sense. It's probably solid shot. But yeah, let's just say they have grape shot. That's fun. Mm -hmm. Um Yeah, the boys open up with the cannons. Okay, the Emperor's boys <laughs> take some hits and they they're going in. Oh shit. Fuck it up. <laughs> Alright. Oh dear! Oh shit, you know what? We These got guys, giant! These guys are gonna go in. I'm gonna charge the oh. Emperor. I'm gonna get him. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh shit. Uh... <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Pull the Emperor! That's so bad. <laughs> oh well. So, uh, it is the spider's turn. Warmech. Uh, I have it dash 60 feet to my allies. Which I, I should, you be, should doing, be able to control it. Yeah, my bad. Yeah. It'd be like around here. The Spudo. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Alright. Oh, so I did look it up. It's It has the uh, classifications of a uh, fiend or fey instead of beast. It would actually have the stats of its form, so that would actually be a plus two dexterity. Mm -hmm. Oh. Is that, uh, is that the... Spider's turn beast? Yeah, it's a 60 foot dash. Alright, well the beast. Okay. Since uh, Senbu has informed me that there is oh any wait, my huh? hold on, <laughs> forty foot dash, not sixty foot. Okay, it has a twenty feet movement yep. speed. You should be able to adjust that. All right, no, adjust. All right. So since Senbu informed me there's enemy skirmishers in wood, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna move to this tree. And uh, use my action to hide. <laughs> yeah. And I'm gonna suggest the party do whispering hand signals. Let's wait for them to come to us and prepare a surprise. How okay. about? Okay. <laughs> we'll just wait, cover, and then. You're the boss. A VC ambush. <laughs> All right. Try it. Stealth. Right. Ooh, okay. I am one with the trees. <laughs> Alright. Captain. Um I am looking up something rather interesting. You're not holding the wood plant. You know the maximum range of a crossbow is three hundred and twenty feet? Yep, can imagine, yeah. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'm, uh, gonna get a location that's at least feasible. I'm gonna run up, I'm gonna take my crossbow, and I'm gonna aim it for way off in the deer stands. Mm -hmm. All the way out to Lieutenant Mandrake over there, which <laughs> yeah. somewhere between that 20 I rolled earlier and 19 passive perception. Oh, is okay. well with him. <laughs> Your first sniper build, I like guess. Sniper elite. <laughs> well, I'm more of a melee build, but. Hmm. Are you gonna make the shot? Why is... Just like to roll. Yeah. All right. Uh, let me open. Let me open my sheet. Dude. Yeah. The cool thing is, a crossbow is functionally silent in this situation. Almost. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. I think I'm curious about is it a heavy or a light crossbow? It's a light crossbow. Okay. 
Hey. So as the boys start charging in, Mr. Mandrok over here takes a hit. Would you like to roll damage? C. Not so C. You know what? That was a very difficult thing to hit. And he is moving. <laughs> like at like galloping speed as they're charging. <laughs> so <laughs> you know what? It's still a miracle. Does it do double? So Does it do double? Why? Just tiny. Don't mind me. Uh, it, uh, you hit him for one damage. And and I will reload uh, the crossbow. Mm -hmm. You know what? We have a quick look and see if we can find his shield or something. Uh, Simbu, would you like to roll the. What are you doing? Uh, Neko? Yeah? It's your turn. Oh, is it? <clears throat> uh, does it look like the enemies are m closing in towards yeah. us, or well, not on are you, they just put on on the on your friends over there? No, I mean you know these guys over here in the tree line. Oh, down there. Yeah, these ones are. No, are they just uh, waiting? They're uh, like whispering and kind of looking around, pointing at the the elves over here. Uh, which ones? Big formation of elves right there. Ah, uh, just the f the front line. Yeah. All right. Uh, so they they're looking in a different direction. I'm gonna try and close in a bit more right to this tree, right here. And um, other than that, I think I'm gonna hold action mm -hmm. to attack. I guess or un until Eldelise gives a signal or something. Uh, who are you uh, preparing your action to attack? The uh, whoever. Well, if Aldelis uh, says anything, you know, open well, fire like or until they detect. Or, like, behind him, which one in particular? Oh, does it matter? Like the first one that comes into range, oh, but okay. uh, or anybody that's in range. If, I see. I see. With your if they I see. Yeah. if they see us or if I get a signal to attack. With your javelin, I see. Yeah. Uh, Gildred. Yes. It's your turn. <clears throat> One second. I'm just uh, assigning the spells I'd have prepared. I forgot to left. I left two of them on. Would you like me to go back to you in a second? And I'll no, no, I'm good. I got guys. it now. I'm good. All right. How far away is this man from me? All right. I'd move. Eh, thirty feet here. It's a little bit close for comfort, but it'll be fine. Is the distance between me and this? All right, cool. Still that far away. Can I ascertain that the it's like a warg, right? That's the thing he's writing? Uh, the lieutenant? It might be. Oh, fuck. Uh, can I ascertain if that might be the alpha of the pack that is currently charging forward? Maybe. Uh, I'll would check you like what to that make uh, some sort of test? Yes. I don't know what that would be. Uh, like nature? Perception, maybe? Ah, uh, perception. Alright, perception. I said perception's kinda shit. Can I use my nature instead? Yeah. Yeah. 19. Yeah, it definitely is the, the alpha of the pack that he's writing. Perfect. Alright. Just so I could block off. Mm. Fuck. 
what's the casting distance for that? I think it's 60 feet. Ah, 120 feet. Goddamn. All right. I like the cast of fog cloud in front of the uh, work pack. Mm -hmm. uh, that would be a 20 foot radius circle. If I can get circle, snap to center, measure origin center. Distance. I need to go back to line real quick. From my spot, 120, so I do have to put it there. All right. Centered on the uh, Warg Alpha. So I have a nice little document here that was translated some stuff into Spanish, and for some reason, Google has translated it back to English, which is not helping. Is there a way I can leave? What? Is there a way I can leave a circle place? Uh, you can probably just use the, the paint tool and just draw it on. Oh, for okay. Sake. Oh, fuck. Mm -hmm. That is, that is not gonna work. <laughs> believe that's a 20 foot spear mm -hmm. now if it allows me to move it's not allowing me to fucking move it so you've cast a fog cloud there yeah? yes cool. Oh, nope, that's not happening. Oof. Empty that, transparent. Alright. There. Go. Is that your turn? Yes, that would, that would be my, Oh, I mean, I move 30 feet, that's my action. I don't think I can cast spells with bonus action. Yeah, that should be my turn. Okay. The boys are going to uh, begin to advance again. Right. Um, Elijah. Yeah, let's do. Shit. Our thoughts. Oh, shit. Uh. Let's try that location instead. Maybe that's better for range. Did on nothing. You know what? I'll. I'll just make sure. I this suppose is I'll try to rush up behind them. Use them for cover. I'll use them for cover and uh, do a performance to, to try to keep the spirits up. With the drum you stole? Well, I wouldn't say stole. You did take it from a dying child. It wouldn't be considered. I mean, he was dead. Yeah. Pilfered. That's a better word. <laughs> Looted. Eh, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I, I do believe... But that's all I could do for Elijah now, considering I rushed. But then I have something lined up for the next one. Mm -hmm. 
That was a perfect music transition and <laughs> drumming. All right. <laughs> so, uh, general Will's <laughs> voice. Uh, you'll hear a shout from over here. Someone is going to shout. He's going to say, uh, "Hang on, let me, let me put him in the right layer." Hmm. He's going to shout. Nope. Uh, Compania <laughs> present <laughs> fire. fire as the boys oh. fucking open fire on Sharp's men from the tree oh, line. Fucking And uh, the boys will start uh, advancing over here. I'm in the wrong layer again. Obviously! Hector the third is just like Hector the first. He has no honor. I need to make a, uh, a test there for. Uh, Mr. Matt and Mr. Dude who got hit with a crossbow ball to see if he seen where it came from. No, he didn't. <laughs> Alright. So. Ormac, the spider. Ah, yes. Do. Oh, that helps actually. That helps a lot. I will move the spider 40 feet this way, and I do have a bit of a question. Mm -hmm. As the spider is sort of like connected to my own mind, as if like as if we share a connection. There's no particular range for that, is there? Uh, well, I have the link with my familiar at 100 feet. Oh, okay, cool. But I was wondering if I could use that as sort of like a, a signal extender for my own telekinesis. You know what? I, ba based on what particular race you are, I have no problem with that. Yeah. So, so it'd be like 100 feet. Standard. Yeah, 100 feet to familiar, si uh, 60 feet from familiar, so I can actually communicate with the party. Huh? And through that, I will speak in. I'm going to talk on the radio. Squad. Yeah, I'll, I'll speak into <laughs> Sylvie's mind. What is the situation over there? <laughs> Voxcaster online. Yeah, that's correct. Appears to be enemy skirmishers in the wood with the same idea as us. And they just open fire on our fellow. I'm thinking of doing a bit of a counter ambush. You could stay tuned. <laughs> the little kobolds yeah. give you a thumbs up and they're yep. ready their crossbows. <laughs> yep. I will give. Alright, go, goes to familiar, goes to me, I would like to reopen line, or open line with sharp through telekinesis and relay that information. You know what, Stu? Four of the kobolds will draw their knives, and he holds, <laughs> one of them will holster a pistol. <laughs> nice, good stuff. He gets his knife in his mouth and ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The London yeah, certified experience. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's your turn then, Alice. Okay. Yeah. They're gonna do a uh, a uh, Royal Marine treatment to these boys. Yeah. I I'm just gonna dash all the way forward to this tree while being as stealthy as I can. Hopefully the gunfire masks are approached somewhere. Yeah. Make a stealth um, test. Yeah. I'll give you a free one. Ooh. Yeah. They didn't notice. Mm -hmm. They're too focused on shooting at Sheriff over there. Yeah. All right. Yep, that was sweet. Captain. Uh, Camorian will try to rush forward and. Be a sneaky boy. Uh, 
Um, definitely having reloaded one of not being particularly sneaky. <laughs> And, yeah, how close? Oh, I get to do something fancy. Um, I'm gonna look at Sylvie and ask, do you want me to attack now or later? Hold for one more moment, i.e. one more round, and then we'll attack. <laughs> okay. Does that include me? <laughs> yeah, but definitely move up to get closer to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll attack. Yeah. Alright, that'll be my turn. Alright then, simple. Alright then, I uh, guess I'll stealth again, right? If I want to move up. Up to you. Oof. <laughs> Stop stumbling through the forest. <laughs> <laughs> Though I doubt they'll hear anything. I've got a little surprise if I can get close to them. So mm -hmm. don't, don't worry too much. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, let's see the ruler. Uh, how much I can move up? Yeah, this is good. Yeah, go ahead. up to here and that's the that's my action oh, right. i am behind cover yeah maybe well there there's a tree here so i must spo yeah, i'm assuming cover. that's cover yeah it's at least half cover at least <laughs> okay that's my turn yep Gildred. Sorry. I'm thinking, sorry. <laughs> it's very, very fucking stressful. Alright, I'd move 20 feet this spot. And I'd convey to Sharp that we are being attacked from the tree line. Okay, look at you, I can't bloody see that! And I'd like to disperse that fog cloud and recast another fog cloud to cover that angle. Alright. You like to just move that one? Uh, yeah, just move it. I don't think I... I'll let you do it. I can, I I can. I'll do that. Yeah. Oh, for some reason I can't just... <laughs> Like right there. That should be within minimal range anyways. I don't know if I could just move it or... I think it would just require just recasting it. Well, you can just easily recast it. Alright, Yeah. Are you? Uh... Yes. Well, it's your boy's turn. Uh, I would actually ask how, uh, what are these two frontline boys over here outfitted with? Oh, these guys? Yeah, well, these guys. They've got muskets and they're uh, pointing the match Fuck. sharp over here and you guys... <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright, never mind, never mind. I yep, actually... Their bayonets are fixed and they're ready to uh, fire oh, okay. a volley and then charge you. <laughs> this, well. is, this is unfortunate. I guess we, I lucked out because they were looking at some other direction. <laughs> they might charge first. This, this might be fine. Alright. Is that you? That should be me. Cause... Alright. 
The Tarp should be able to charge. Jaeger them. Marines over here are going to take a full on charge from Mr. Zan and his boys. They're also going to get a bit fucked up from the other guys over here. The Emperor is still fighting away in the, in the north. Cannons are going mad, just lobbing shots into the uh, big bulk of troops there. Uh, Mr. Sharp orders another volley and then orders a charge. God oh, damn, that's ballsy from a skirmisher line. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They've been pushed. Yeah. They're outnumbered. <laughs> they can't get shot if they're with you know, Yeah, the volume of fire is a bit too much for them. Yeah. Yeah. I think that fog cloud should still pitch. block that line this side. Oh yes, I forgot these uh, guys over here. These dudes. Mm. Where does it keep me? These guys are going to keep on, uh, on you, uh, Stu. Yep. Move in behind you. They all have, like, knives and everything ready. Yeah. Crossbows ready to go. In fact, two of them uh, will uh, take a shot. Uh, one of them will take a shot. With his little crossbow. He also has a little crossbow. He's got a pew. Because, uh,. That's the wrong one, isn't it? That's a Damn, old that one. is a natural one. That is a cobalt one, okay, yeah. I, I've actually set on the, uh, on the wrong character. There we go. But yeah, he pews at him and he goes in the wild and hits a tree. Boo. <laughs> Boo. Elijah. Mr. Shyam! <laughs> he can't hear you, he's just charged with his big heavy brass. Right, left, sword. yeah! Yeah. Gildred! Yes? Fancy, fancy fellow. Right or left? Should I go right or left? As far as, like, where to approach this from? Well, let's just say I got something up my sleeve, but I need to... You know, right or left? I'd say... right. <laughs> let's go. If you don't intervene on that right. line of men, yes. they're going to be a problem. Well, I'm casting Cloud of Daggers. <laughs> oh, <I'm> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> well, oh, shit. Cast it in the sucks. middle of them. Well, them. You cast it on them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you fucking pet. Alright. Uh, how much damage does that do? Say Enough. Come on. That's five feet cube. That's, uh, That's even better that because the concentration <laughs> spell. <laughs> and that's... Five meters, so we we'll take it from the front. So, how, how do we get them to stay on there? What's it? The measurements. Uh, uh, if you just can... just use the the paint tool and draw. On the if map. you can, if you can keep that shape, I could just make a paint tool for that. Hey, ship. Or if it's going like that, then it'll be like... We can also like... do that one, I suppose. There we are. Dink, right? Oh, shit. Yeah, because it's... Uh, let's see. About that much. Because I'm um, casting it at here, yeah. Yeah, and then it's going out five on each, yeah. That Eight. poor dude. How much damage is he taking past that? 44. 44. Let's see. Okay, um, so for now, uh, I don't think there is anything, but it's 44 when they start there, or if they enter it. Yeah, so for the first time on a turn. That should qualify. Suppose it's 1D 
that's the 44. Should I just roll it? We are supporting this line of skirmishers the best we can. Thirteen damage. Thirteen damage. To every, everyone in that square, or just the one guy? All right. Uh, well, that should weird. be for everyone within this. Yes. Oh, I see. Square. So one, two, three, four. Five. And then next time, um, let's see. Next time they stop their turn, I might also have to roll. So it's. Or if somebody else enters it. Let's just, just say I, I really like this spell from Baldur's Gate 3. <laughs> and I. In really open my eyes for, for the damage potential tasks. Yeah, you just messed up uh, like a good portion of that, uh, that line there. It's, uh, it's only once you guys get hit with knives, I don't know. <laughs> Wait. Alright, is that your turn? You have gone. Uh, I suppose he'll, he'll end it with shouting. No, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna shout. That's just gonna draw attention to me. I'm gonna message the guy in the center. Yeah. If I can do it like a follow-up action with the with the, the message comfort. Go on. Beware. You've gotten evil spirits on yourselves now <laughs> to draw back. All right. You done? Let's see if the superstitious. <laughs> yeah. All right. It is their turn. <sighs> the uh, heavy. Well, uh, I guess heavy-ish cavalry because more of a medium cavalry. Well, uh, break on these boys and uh, start reforming. They begin fighting them. These boys okay. here are going to uh, <laughs> present arms. <laughs> and Fuego on you there, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Pirate. <laughs> are you ready, Pastor? <laughs> Rape the whirlwind. I'm just standing here! <laughs> Menace. I'm from walking here! I'm... Oh! I got hit, I got hit, I got hit. <laughs> I also got hit. <laughs> Alright, one, two, three, four. Let me find a... 14, 20, 24. You've just Calculate. barely survived that. <laughs> Fuck. That's, that's 24 damage. Blessed be I. They are going to, uh. My friend is hurt. This is bad. Yeah. Is this all he can do? They're gonna continue against the pole here and, uh. Come on! Come on! Come on! Uh, these guys over here uh, have spotted uh, uh, Captain and uh, Simbu over here. And they're also going to open fire on you. Uh, this is on Simbu and this is on Captain. Simbu, what is your AC? Uh, 18. 18. 19 is a hit. Yeah, but did I not have cover? You have half cover. You're right. That's at least two AC addition on top of that, so there you go. He missed. Yeah, my AC 16. 16. Captain, the guy shoots at you, he just hits the tree right right next to you. It's really close, mm. but he missed. Mm. Alright. 
spider. Woman. I I would like to ask because I just want to make sure it's being accounted for. Is our artillery line firing upon? Yep. Anybody? Okay. Good. Gotcha. All right. Um, I'll move this. They're trying to not hit the danger close. Yeah, that's fair. They're firing at the guys further away. That'd be the, that's 40 feet. That's still within range, that's good. Uh, I'm gonna telepathically communicate the captain that, uh... I don't... Fuck, what's your name, Pasta? I'm on... Elijah. Black Sail? Yeah. Black Sail, right? Black Sail. All right. Um, Mr. Blacktail has taken a grievous Black wound. Blacktail, Elijah, whatever you want. Yeah, Mr. Elijah has taken a grievous wound. I am sending him your way. I I'm believe that would end the spider's turn. <laughs> when advancing in open battle, never march into your own firing squad. That is my response. That's fair. Don't, 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 don't I think I have some wounds. <laughs> I only did it when, uh... Well... When they shot me. That would end the spider's turn. Alright. So... Let's let the spider... Actually, let's move the dash communication. That's about it. Ooh. Yeah. Stupid. Been right. engaged. Congratulations. Yeah, I can reach this line. Um, I will a little specify, bit. Stu. They've not noticed you, but they've noticed yeah. the rest of your squad. So I'm thinking. Yeah. Um, you and the kobolds are very completely invisible. <laughs> yeah. Could I still be stealthy if I dash over there, potentially? Uh, in the smoke, you can probably cross the open line, the open line, as they've created smoke firing at your friends. So. Right. You be able to you just make a stealth test for me to do it. Right, I'm just kind of hunkered down. You can there. do it with advantage because you have the mask in the world. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Try that. Yeah. Because okay. you were obscured by the smoke, so. I feel yeah, like that's so, uh, still count. I'm going for the uber stealth and literally hiding behind this intro. It looks yeah, next. That's to literally them. <laughs> next to you. Yep. Yeah. All right. But I'll whisper to them before I go. Just engage it to our leisure. <laughs> I'm getting into a better position. Yeah. The Good guys luck. put away their crossbows and they all draw their knives. Yep. <laughs> you can see them getting all that. They all stabby you at the moment as they're getting they're all hyped. Yep, that's oh, the key. Yeah. That's supposed to be my last stealth for me. <laughs> oh shit, the Glasgow special. Alright. Yeah. Captain. Camorian has decided that he needs a bit of cover. Camorian is going to move up here and still have line of sight of this guy. Because mm -hmm. I assume this is basically kind of a tree stump. I'll say behind those big trees, these are trees, not stumps, but yeah. Um, these big trees, are, you have at least half cover behind the big ones. Small ones, not yeah. so much, but the big ones, yes. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna look this guy with my crossbow. Yeah. And I am going to open fire. Go ahead. I get it. Maybe not so good. You know what? That's a miss. Alright. And for my reaction, or my bonus action, I would like to cast Spiritual Weapon. Oh no. I must refresh my roll 20. One second. Yeah, I'm gonna give you this little token as your 
thing, because I feel like I think spiritual weapon is a thing you need to put down. Would you would like to do some boo on your turn? Oh, well, Captain. since. Okay. And. So, uh, chuck this, uh, symbol, this token down wherever you want your spiritual weapon. Okay. Let me just get a range. Yep. Um, he's gonna hit, um, the guy on the right here. Mm -hmm. He's gonna put it in a, on his side. Yep. He's gonna have the spiritual weapon take the form of a mace. Cool. Big bunky stick. Okay. Yep. And it is gonna hit him for 1d8 plus spellcaster ability modifier, which is wisdom. Mm -hmm. So 1d8 plus 4. Do five damage. Nice. And that'll be my turn. Um, reload my crossbow. Yep. I'm guessing this dude is occupied with the weapon for now, so I'm gonna move up here. Uh, and let's see what. Let's see my third feet. No, I'll throw. Uh, I'll throw a hand axe at this guy. All right. <laughs> Tomahawk. And, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, watch out, Mel Gibson's here. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's it's the same damage in roll as the javelin, so I'll just use that. Well, the range is a bit shorter, but uh, he's within range, so I'll just use the javelin. Is your current hit points 49? I noticed you forgot to change it on the opposite side of your health pool oh. there. Yeah. yeah. Just so you don't get confused later when your health is less than it should be. Yeah, how do I do that? Yeah, uh, hang on, I'll just do it. So, you don't think that did that work correctly? Uh, you threw your javelin. You uh, so hit the word the word javelin in the in the chat. Yeah, I did. In the chat. There oh. you go. You deal four piercing. Da you throw a javelin at this guy. Is it? Yeah. I thought it was a tomahawk. Okay. So a well, uh, it's a tomahawk, but it's the same like damage. Oh, it's the same damage. So. You chuck a tomahawk at him, a and you catch him for four damage. Oh, and a plus one bonus to the attack and damage rolls for uh, the magic arrow thing. So that's a uh, one more damage. Oh, an extra damage. Okay. Yeah. Cool. And that's uh, that's my turn. This guy is not happy. Well, can I do a uh, <laughs> what's it called? A bonus action to roll for stealth again? Try and hide. For now, I'll allow it, but I'm not sure you have a thing to do that. Go ahead. Alright, never mind then. You are obscured in, in rough terrain. Um, Alright, so, uh, Gildred. Warmack. Yes. Sorry, I was, I was making realistic fuck fuck. Here we go. Yeah. 
your All body right. is just got shot by a volley. <laughs> yeah, I see that. That's that's not good. Luckily, one of the one of the bullets missed you. But it came in your general direction after he drew attention to himself. All right, I'm gonna have to do it. I gotta get out of here. I hear you, fam. All right. Once again, having to pull up the goddamn spell list. It just keeps closing on my end for some damn reason. I'm kind of curious. What is the, uh, the land speed on the? Uh... Oh. I think I know it's about to go down. <laughs> All right, this is gonna be this is gonna be something. All right, I'm going to cast Phantasmal Force. I believe the spell say DC is 14. It's going to be on that Alpha Warg that's coming around in our direction. Range 60 feet, I think that should reach. Oh, fuck. I'll, I'll change my movement to accommodate then. Alright. I think you're stuck in the uh, room or two if I need to turn it off. Uh, no, that's just a linger that's on. Oh, you can do a linger thing? Okay. Yeah. That's helpful. Alright, hold on. That was like right here. I'd actually like to move. Because this is this guy. Th I'm worried about this. I'd like to cast Phantasmal Force on that fuckwit, on his dog. Okay. So the Alpha Warg will have Heck to make yeah. a. Yes. I'm just curious if he could, if he, if he noticed. All right, go on. It's it's routing. What do you mean? <laughs> All right. Uh. Hold on. DMs real quick. Just so the image will be used. <laughs> I just see past skip in the Discord. The <laughs> uh, Drew Car or Jim Carrey one? No, the uh, the fucking lady. What's her name? I've been shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the illustration of how uh, Eloise is. You've been shot right, four uh, times. <laughs> uh, ten oh foot large of the image I added you on in DMs. Oh yeah, yeah sorry. Uh, I need to upload those. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. It, it will be. It will appear. Fine to put the drawing tool down. Or the measure tool. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Sort of like that. No. Delete. This is separate to your uh, your spider, yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. But that does mean fog cloud goes down because that's concentration. Yeah. Uh, can you delete the fog cloud then? And I'll just upload this really quick. Yeah. I am now spawning a rival in front of this fuckwit. And because he's alpha, uh, 10 by 10. A 10 by 10? Yes. Oh, uh, you want where that is there? Oh. Yeah. And because he's alpha, he might convince the other wargs to attack, despite the fact it's not there. Lamau. <laughs> well. And. Clever. If I could cast bonus action mold earth to make a five foot barrier in front of pasta so he doesn't get shot again uh, in the front okay, you, I'll let you uh, just draw one like on the map just grab the pen tool yeah, yeah, and draw yeah. a barrier I mean I do also have fantastical force good for that but I think uh, it sounds like you I'm kinda... just gonna try to book it I, I think I'm just gonna try to run for it nope. But, uh, worst case, I do have fun. <laughs> you are getting... A wall, like, there, so it could block shots from that corner. Maybe. Actually, right. if I... Hold on. 
If I put it... If I can fucking move it... I don't yeah, know why your, I can't move that Does your dagger thing go down past that? There it is. Yeah, uh, that, if it is concentration, he would have to roll for yeah, a save. It's got, oh, you lost it when it, you got it, shot. Uh, these, the thing is, I, yeah, yeah, well, when I got shot, I... <laughs> if, if I put it... Because I need to maintain concentration. Alright, oh, you're getting shot four times to stop me keeping your concentration. <laughs> yeah. I see. Um... If I put it to his left instead of his top left, would that still block the shots that came from for I'll, him? I'll say it'll block, it, block the shots, or at least give him half Okay. Quick. I don't know. Yeah. Alright. Because if that's the case, then I'd put it there. But if it's not the case, I'd put it to the yep. top left. Alright. Alright, that should be my turn. Okay. Uh, the boys are gonna continue fighting. Um... You dumb bitch. <laughs> yep. they're, they're having a big slap fight over here. Just all the boys. Oof. Cannons going off. What not. The cheerleader over here. Just cheering them on. <laughs> uh, yeah, Elijah. Basta. Yes, I'm gonna fucking run for it. You gonna book it for the trees? Yep. Like it, good man. I was thinking of casting Vortex Warp on you, but you should run yourself. Yep. I'm fucking running. Brother, I was hey, running. Like, fuck. I'm dashing over there, and uh, yeah, that's, that's me for now. Alright then. So this thing... Uh, they appeared in front of the boys. Run, gonna run for it as fuck. Is it solid? Yeah. Yes. Alright, so they can run into it. Uh, well, it's... They they probably run through it, but they will, well, yeah. like... They'll run through the it and be confused, just... because they were at full gallop. <laughs> yeah. The, the whole concept is that, no matter what happens, it's like... They, they rationalize that it actually isn't that way. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. and they too do Be take damage for a it. moment. Do, do they take damage from it? I mean, if they uh, ran, if, the, if the thing that, that is... they ran into it at full speed. Well, it's it's a ghost. It doesn't. It's, but... it's not a physical thing. It, it's a, yeah. it's an illusion. It's not real. Yes, but yeah. uh, if you read the uh, I'm trying the to spell read it. correctly. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, I haven't been able to read it because I'm uh, doing too many things. Uh, it's, it's an illusion, but if they believe it, would have, it, it would have taken the one. It would have taken the one d six psychic damage when I spawned it. Oh, initially. But in this to... circumstance, it only affects a person that has been like visually. I believe it only affects one, one creature. So that you were after the warg, was it? Yes, it, it affected yeah. the warg. Yeah, can you roll the D6? Did you roll a D6 that time? I did not. Oh yeah, can you do that please? I will. While I try and uh, figure out what its stats are. Five. There's uh... Too many things are happening. Um, a five. I am too close. <laughs> Put it this way. Boy here locks eyes with you, <laughs> and it gives Drugs. you a, it gives you a friendly salute and a smile. <laughs> it says, "Hello, friend." I, I speak in the battle? mind. Hello. <laughs> I'm not yourself? doing too well. I'm He's having a great die. time. <laughs> <laughs> he looks a bit a bit you know perturbed by the massive creature that appeared, but he uh, he's he's enjoying himself. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Master Stu. Yep. <coughs> um, you hear something. At the conflict, I have my hands up. 
you hear something a bit uncomfortable. Bro. As, uh, out from the bushes, uh, as if it didn't even notice that you were there. <laughs> <laughs> out from the bushes steps, uh, a big boy. I'm trying to remember, okay. are these, are these large creatures or are they medium? I think they're medium, okay. Oh, fuck, it's the werebore things from the cabin. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh no! <laughs> Two of the boys transform into werebores. What is it like XCOM 2 when that random civilian turns into a giant fucking shapeshifter? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh no! Oh yeah, the faceless things, whatever they're called. Yeah, 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 exactly that. Yeah. The, the mud, <laughs> the mud monster. And uh, one of them is gonna rush you, Simbu. Well, good luck to him. Yeah, and the other one is gonna rush Captain. And accidentally run. These guys running into Captain around the around the tree that way. <laughs> There you go, uh, Simbu. Uh, a fucking boar just came out of nowhere and is <laughs> came up behind you. Uh, he is going to attempt to attack you. With his, uh, his double attack. He's going to attack you with his tusks. Apparently, he doesn't have None of them claw hit. attacks or something. The same as you, Captain. I believe both missed. <laughs> mm. Yeah. What they gonna do? Alright. I have a question across. Are were creatures susceptible to radiant damage? Uh just put a picture. Uh these. I believe were creatures are just immune to only normal physical attacks that aren't silvered. Yeah, I think that's not so I think silver is the only thing that would be used to. Silver, things. magical weapons, and magical effects. Yeah, silver or magic. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Ah. There's something that actually comes up with this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's almost as if it was done on purpose. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, I think for now, that's them. Oh, my. Um. Spider. Shit. Spider. Yeah. Hmm. Booderman. I need to check something first. Am I still within? Ah, shit. Move that up one. Mm -hmm. All right. Yep. Uh, that is sort of the max range I can walk, because that's a hundred feet from me. I don't know, like, if I could look at this real quick. Fucking... Oh, okay. This is still fine. If I can keep right. that there, yeah. There we go. We were 40 feet. <laughs> we'll then again message to Camorian, I believe, and be asking what the situation is over there. Lots of fucking hair. <laughs> Dully noted. <laughs> Don't split the party. 
communication shifting back to me, shifting back to Sharp. We have a hairy situation down south. <laughs> Sharp will show what? <laughs> <laughs> what? A furry oh, no, situation. Oh, oh, he's in his own oh, hairy situation. <laughs> I'll ask tele uh, teleportation, but or not teleportation. His squad shit. of like ten guys are taking on what like forty <laughs> men. Te telepathy <laughs> network back all the way, Camorian. What exactly do you find as hairy situation? Where where more? All right, goes back to head. <laughs> he um, looks at the forty men. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Apparently, there's a where more situation on the tree line. Kind of busy at the moment. <laughs> I'm just giving you a warning. <laughs> Alright, that should be the turn. <laughs> Alright. A release. Alright. A werebore just, um, just rushed to the trees and ra ran at your friends. Between yeah. <laughs> and I just watched that happen. Like, yeah, oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> um, so, Cross, I think you might have forgot to move those this turn. Uh, their, their turn, unfortunately, is at the end. Oh, you're the right, I did forget. Yeah, th yeah, they moved up to you. There you go. Okay, cool. Because they keep getting left behind. So Alright. Like, it's tiny. Fine. So yeah, they move up All to right. you, but they're quite quite far away from the enemies. Okay. But now, now they're ready to pounce. Alright, your turn. So... <laughs> oh, I'm tempted to do this. Yeah? Yeah, you know what? Well, fuck it. Let's just do it for the meme. You have a if I stand the around, right in front of you, by the way. If I stand, like, around there, could they all see and hear me? If you stand? Yeah, they should. If I just dash you. over there and you see where the ruler yeah, is, yeah. Yeah. would they all, all the rest of these skirmishers, they'll see and hear me? Yeah. Uh, all but this one guy out here who's probably being yeah, deafened by all the noise. Yeah. That's fine. I will. <laughs> Leap up gracefully and all that shit, and all that and shit, and dash over there and uh, channel divinity. <laughs> um, we're going to do, use the conquering presence divinity. Do two of them get opportunity attacks? On you? I have no idea. <laughs> they will uh, attempt to grab you, at least. That's okay. you get you trigger that. I'm just gonna roll d20 twice. Against your AC, whatever it is. Uh, no, they both miss. No, they, they're like, oh shit, this is a woman. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then you, and do, I'm gonna you do your thing. Go shout ahead. something edgy like, um, let me see. Commando! <laughs> yeah, yeah, or like, cower before the forest spirits. Oh shit, shit. Like you, are, like you are the divine yeah. forest spirit. I uh, see. So, as an action, I force every creature that can see me within 30 feet to make a wisdom saving throw. Alright, okay. Or they become frightened. Uh, the DC is 14. But... He's fine, I guess. Uh, yeah, they apparently succeeded as <laughs> they go. What the hell? Where did you come from? Can I make from? all of them test? Before. Well, do you want me to do all of them? Because that might. Yeah, I think ages. that would be fair. Cause all right. Uh, I'm so scaring one, all of them. Two, so. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So three are fine, and then five are. The captain. The captain now. just turns and looks at you and levels his pistol. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's fine. laughs> so. Oh, the five of them get the frightened condition, and basically they're on disadvantage to ability checks and oh. attack rolls while they can see me. And they cannot willingly move closer to me. But they do get the ability to snap out of it at the end of their turns if they roll a success or yeah, wisdom yeah. thing. Yeah, if they succeed in a wisdom check at the same DC again. Try. There we go. That's my turn. Yep. Uh, Captain. Gamorian is not impressed by the furry fuck about to be pressed into the ground. <laughs> Gamorian, as his bonus action, is gonna take that spiritual weapon and smash this one's head in. Uh, 
one, two, eight, four. And he's going to smash this one's head in with the spiritual weapon. Mm -hmm. For nine damage. Kamorian's gonna pull out his mace and smack attack this motherfucker across upside the head. I've been waiting to use this, my friend. I only pray for your salvation. magic <clears throat> there you go it has taken nine damage from the magical weapon that's a lot of health yes it does <laughs> There's a reason why you were warned about the werepores. Simbo, I could use some help over here. <laughs> you just die. All right. Wait, this this guy's dead, right? The guy next to me, not yeah, the board, the other guy. Yeah, the red X is dead. Yep. Yeah, 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 right. yeah. Simbo. Is it my turn? It's yep. my turn. There is a werebore trying to fucking attack you with his tusks. I'm just going to ignore it. Yep. Uh, let's see, what is the distance? I see. So this is 60 feet. Hmm. Well, it's probably too far away from me now. So what I am going to do is... I mean, you could try to book it, but probably soon. It gets you move away from him, you provoke the attack of opportunity just to hold him. I know. So if I go like this, like this, and here, yeah. I won't provoke any attacks of opportunity, so I'm just gonna move in between these two. Mm -hmm. And I'll provoke an attack of opportunity. And he can roll. Wait, two attacks? Yeah, he of attacks opportunity? Twice. He has multiple no, attacks. Jesus. I. Don't know if that's how it works, but okay. Yeah. Werebore makes two attacks. Of opportunity? That's yeah. just weird, but okay. Fine. I oh, guess you it's me. Yeah. One, two. It's uh, 16. Unless you can make a, can make a dex or a DC con save. Uh. Oh, oh dear, are we going to get the werewolf priest? Oh shit, you prevented yourself from catching lycanthropy. Congrats. Will you take 60 damage? The 16 damage is here. Sorry, we're born lizard man. I did it not save. You I save against stuff. catching like cats, but you still take 60. No, 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 I meant the. Oh, yeah, yeah no, I see it. Number. I see it, it, uh, it appeared now. It took a second, but it's appeared. Okay. What were you doing? Well, I, I moved. 
Yeah, you moved I, and then did I what? booked it. You just ran over well, there. I, yeah. Cool. It, there was right. a dash. Killed it. Killed it. More mic? My bad. I've been speaking. My mic was muted. Okay. Shit. Okay. I think it's time to help the war front. Yep. I'd like to move 30 feet to that location and cast Magnify Gravity at a point of my preference. Alright, where's the point? One moment, I need to actually put the spell down. Do, 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 do. Hopefully this works. Yes. Spell save DC 14. 10 feet radius, measure tool. Oh shit. I closed the measure tool, stupid son of a bitch. I'd say... Oh, yeah. What do you mean? About there. Yeah, what does that do? That will do... Let's see. On a fail save, takes 2d8 force damage. Constitution saving throw. Would you like to roll that? Uh, the damage? Yeah. Okay. Do they need to make a save? Yes, constitution. Constitution saves for those boys. Versus 12 damage. Okay. 13. Nine. Very what glorious. Was, what was the DC? 14. Alright, they roll a 13. They take 12 damage. And their movement speed is halved. That would probably be like almost the entirety of that back line, half of the front line, and I guess one or two additional soldiers from the top right. Let me just do this, and then <coughs> hang on. Don't get excited yet. I just do this because they're the same damage. Oh, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> they survived twelve. Uh, yeah, they, uh, they went from full health to that. That's a damn shame. Mm -hmm. no. Okay, bonus action, I'd like to shift that, uh, that five, uh, foot of dirt I made into blocking my <laughs> north. I like how it's just a moving pound nice. there. <laughs> Whoa. That is mold earth. Yeah. <laughs> this is beautiful. You're very... <laughs> you're owning the battlefield, man. <laughs> <laughs> this was the you're idea. You're doing fantastic. <laughs> I'm trying, bro. <laughs> I've thrown smoke clouds. I've, I'm throwing <laughs> gravity. I'm gonna die. I do ask, as a part of Vortex Warp, can I warp myself 90 feet in a direction? Is that, is that a, another spell, or is that a that is a, action? That's a two-tier. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I'm asking for future. Oh, In well, case I, I get surrounded so. by wargs. I guess so. Okay. I can delete that now. I believe that would be my turn. Mm -hmm. I'm helping! <laughs> I, have Fuck. A I have a question in regard to that thing. If they move away, then really are help. is there anything preventing them from ignoring it? Or uh, do they have to address well, it? They, like, what, what, they have to, what they have to rationalize it like it's an actual creature. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah. It... It, uh, uh, think of it like mind games they, they think that there it. is a right. they, they think there is a they, like some of them think there's think a creature real. there and some are confused because they move through it <laughs> yeah All it's right. well uh Let's... as a part of phantasmal force they yeah. rationalize anything that seems unreasonable all right okay. mm -hmm. uh, I'll, I'll do so that. like if they went that. through it they'll be like it's a monster made like, of smoke the, or something for any reason i'll do that on their turn oh. yeah it basically, like the, a ten-foot monster just appeared in the back line. That's what they rationalized I'll, it as. I'll, I'll, I'll deal to that on their turn. Yep, yep. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, 
too. Four, five, six. I should probably roll those with advantage, but never mind. Um, so, Stu. Yep. You're over here. Sorry, I moved oh, to accident. <laughs> you're over here. <laughs> this captain levels his pistol at you. Senbu dives in front, willing to sacrifice oh. his life to take a bullet oh, for you. That's not what happened. And then he is fucking sure. like mauled to death by a fucking cobalt <laughs> with a knife who just cobalt keeps commander. stabbing <laughs> his gun out of nowhere. Fuck oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. This other boy. You keep his fist. He's <laughs> uh, he's knifed for uh, five damage. Uh, this boy here is knifed for, I believe, six damage. Uh, this boy for four damage. Audience at home to see how bad I am in pants. Oh, uh, uh, that guy's not getting knifed. This guy is though. Uh, he gets one, four, four, so. These kobolds are dangerous. <laughs> yeah, they're the commandos. <laughs> <laughs> did I forget this guy? I think I did. Okay, cool. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not saying anything against it, just it's so yeah. beautiful to see this in action. Yeah, <laughs> we're the Kiplingberg Commandos. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> Bad uh, manners in the depths of the forest. These boys are gonna just rush their pipe, pull your Jeez. pylon by accident. How, how, how am I catching your pylon? Yeah, every time I try to move these guys, they're getting caught on your uh, thing for some reason. They're gonna fix bayonets and just rush in. <laughs> okay. Can't believe they bayonet this. Yeah, okay. Uh, Elisha. As you look up, Elijah, you see the uh, the ward guys uh, confused and trying to figure out what's going on as there's a massive creature amongst them. Uh, Zan will catch your eye and he will give you a smile and a nod, oh. wave his hat at you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. Hello. I guess, I guess I'll wave back. <laughs> Alright. So what are you gonna do? See you later! What are you gonna do, Pastor? No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Far, far fucking... I'm moving to the trees. Yeah, I'm gonna cast kill As you move into the trees, you see a werebore balling your friend over here. <laughs> Ah, you got yourself a little pet. There's a handful. Looks cool. Uh, maybe I'll try that later. Anyways, let's see if I can uh, get some help. Um, that should be... Hey, that's pretty good. <laughs> Ten healing, okay. Fair enough. It's something. Um. Yep, cast cure wounds on yourself. Heal yourself also saying, man. this is fucking chaos. Yeah. <laughs> Are you saying that with positivity However, or with uh, within... negativity? Uh... Uh... I'm saying that with positivity. All right, gain All yourself, this gain yourself a piety me. point, Pasta. <laughs> Gonna have to do it. I had to do a double take there. Yeah. Because yeah, it's a good. 
Yeah. All right. Thing in it. What are you doing? Yes. Uh, that should be all for me for now. But I am gonna. Yeah. It's all for me for now. But I will be looking at their way. That way more suspiciously. And if that thing acts, I might have a spell planned. That thing is it. Well, that's the reactionary spell, so it has to do something. Mm -hmm. So what spell? What spell, Pasta? I cut out? No. No, it's he possible. He probably stepped no, away. I hear you. I'm just double, double checking. Oh, wait, shit. Oh, well. One thing. Hmm? I missed something. Yeah? That's an additional five psychic damage to the head ward. Sorry, uh, you, you fellas cut off on it there a bit. Yep. Nice. Very cool. I forgot to roll the psychic okay, damage, okay, okay. that's my bad. Right, uh, Pasta, what, what were you doing? Because you cut out and we had no idea what you're saying. Aside from cur so I'm not doing anything additional aside from curing my own wounds. Oh, you're just I'm curing just wounds. And you're going to shout at the, the boar. Let's see what it's going to do. No, no, no. Uh, watch the boar, not shout. Oh, you're going to look at him and be like, oh, look, it's a werebore. Let's just say. Indeed. But also, I'm gonna watch for anything I can... Anything it succeeds on that I can react to, because I have a spell lined up. But I have to see it succeeding at something. Mm -hmm. First. So I'll be watching it attentively. Alright. Is that you? That's you. That is me. Yeah. All right then. The battle line is going to explode with more cannon fire and gunfire and bayonets and gurn arguing uh, along the line. Um, I'm not going to bother animating every single one of those people, so you can imagine it with your imagination. And, yeah. Uh, uh you could probably just treat one of them as like a part of the battalion, so it'd be like put it into entire yes. battalion. <laughs> I didn't want to get bogged down with my mass combat too much. Um, yes. So how do the the hobgoblins break out of this? They need to do some sort of uh, was it a wisdom save? Yeah, they yes. at the end of their turns need to pass a wisdom save at fourteen. Otherwise, they're frightened still. It does take an action to do so. Yeah. So the uh, the boys need to beat fourteen. Yeah, most of them are beating. It looks like except one. <laughs> Two of them are left behind. There you go. Yeah. The ones that are still frightened get yeah, disadvantage in all their check, basically. Because so, they're too spooked to do uh, effectively. Oh my I god, guess. I'm getting stuck on things. Huh? There we go. <laughs> These boys start riding on. They ride past you, Warmick. Oh, wait, uh, no, this is, this is on the wargs. This is not on the hobgoblins. On the wards? Oh, okay. Well, yeah, it was yeah, on the uh, ward. I, I, I'll sort that out later. Uh, okay. Pasta. Zan will call <laughs> out to you as he rides past and say, Need a, need a medic? Me. <laughs> <laughs> um. Unless you're. Um, yeah, unless you're licensed, no. <laughs> He's offering to give you a lift. <laughs> if you need a medic, he'll take you to one. Are you sure? Okay, sure. Can I can I make sense motive on this being somewhat in range? 
I'm trying to figure out what this guy's entire thing is. Yeah, go on. Okay. This is this is very weird. He's just having a he's just having a good time like a fucking yeah, he's he's enjoyed himself. So much, too. If this would load. Yeah. No, he seems to be genuine. <laughs> like, oi, even though you're my enemy, like, you're still you're, you're seem still my friend. You want a you want a medic? <laughs> Some good sportsmanship. <laughs> Some nice fighting. <laughs> I'd appreciate it, sure. Yeah. Then hop on. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> so odd. In the fairness, best fucking you, infiltration tactic. you might get a ride to his camp to do some shenanigans, so, yeah. I... <laughs> Alright. Nice. The Warbeck, it's uh, the spider's turn. Fighter, no, uh, fuck. Just gotta. I have re replaced, so I just need to. What the fuck is it? There's line. Alright, so it's got some distance to actually walk. Alright. <laughs> Say about like here. Mm hmm. I guess it, at that point we'll probably take an action to stealth and hide. Yeah, what do you do that? Be... I just realized I forgot the goblins that are fighting the, uh, the kobolds. Oh, my bad. No, no, you keep, you keep going, I'm gonna do it in the background. Yeah, yeah, no, of course. No, just... That... I guess it just do a... D, 1d20 plus 2 for a stealth check. <laughs> I, d I didn't realize how, uh, how low health kobolds have. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty scrawny. Oof. Alright. Uh, no, not so the homie. <laughs> what's the 18 on? Uh, still check for the spider. Spider, okay, cool. Is that your turn? Yeah, pretty much. That spider doesn't do much. Yeah. All right, I'll release. Oh, shit. two of your right. kobold companions have taken hits. However, the guy next to you, the captain, has dropped his Pretty officer's dead. pistol and he's been knifed to death by a kobold. Awesome. <laughs> uh, right. I can either attack or heal, basically. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I'll tell you what, I'll save the healing for later. I need to kill some of these fucks. Uh, right. For a bonus action, I'm gonna use... Uh, where is it? A uh, Searing Smite to buff my weapon into a fire weapon. Nice. Okay. <laughs> so I can set these fuckers on low fire. Yeah. Which might have some interesting consequences. Uh, and then I'll attack this guy next to me. Yeah, go ahead. I get advantage because he's like double flanked. He is very flanked. Okay. Oh, that's really unfortunate. <laughs> you know what? Because it's a double, like, digit, like it's cloned, and it's, right. you know, the same number twice. Uh, I believe in, you remember in Warhammer Fantasy that was a, a crit? I'm not going to count mm. it as a crit, but I'm going to give you a bonus on the roll, just because chaos okay. reasons. And it was invoked, rule, rule, a thing rule, was invoked yeah. previously by another player. So, uh, mm. for chaos reasons, maybe chaos is on your side this time. Oh and um, I'm going to give you a little <laughs> bit of bonus on that roll, while I check um. his... Uh, Now, real question is, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I for one think it's a good thing. <laughs> we don't have chaos implications here. It's fine. Uh, do you? Well, I mean, like, the, yeah. the implications yeah. of chaos is... I don't uh, Stu. Yep. You've, you've caught him with your light. Roll damage. Okay. Always. Roll the damage and then uh, we're doing a D6 fire down. 
that should. Good. That should. Fourteen. You have so. killed the man. As you have hey. set him on fire. As he died. <laughs> <laughs> Let's awesome. go. He's like, no, why me? <laughs> <laughs> That's a horrific way to kill someone. <laughs> By the way, the fire he had gunpowder on him. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I had a feeling that would happen as well. <laughs> you know what? But what are the uh, his his like uh, gunpowder little pouch just just goes off and does uh, more damage to this cobalt here? No, my boy. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not the, the, the shot Damn. and the, the gunpowder go off with like a shotgun and just fucking blast it. Okay. Yeah. Mix success then. Alright. There That's you go. Me, I guess. Actually, technically, I get movement. Uh, uh, you should be able to move still. I don't think you used your movement. This I'll guy over here guy. is lining up a shot on Cobalt. You know what, I'll interpose myself there. Haha, yeah. -ha, no. Be a chat. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Kimura. Boy. Captain. I'm beginning to weigh my absence. Oh. You have heard, uh, Mundruk over here offer a friendly helping hand <laughs> to your companion. I gotta stand and fight, I'll stand and fight. You think I'll you move my spear. I don't know. But in the name of the hand of the mummy in the name of the mummified hand, I will protect the innocent. And I will protect the subjects of his majesty's language. I will fight. And I will use my re um, spiritual weapon and attack this were um, werebore. Yeah. Captain. Game one. Yes. One fight. Right. Hit him for eight damage. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna smack this were other werebore with my weapon. You gained, uh, for yeah, your devotion to the moment fight hand, you gained the piety. Um, Sinbu, Neko. Yep. It is your turn. Uh, man, all these people are dead around me. Well, I guess nothing's stopping me. There's uh, a pistol at your feet. I don't know how to use that. It looks like you'd be used as a club. Ow. Ooh, metal stick. <laughs> Uh, let's see. I guess I can't pass the. Uh... This man is uh, readying his weapon to sh shoot at you. He's Which one? At you. Which Menacingly. one? Which one? This one. The one who's terrified over here. Oh, he's terrified. But he's yeah. fine. He's readying uh... his weapon to shoot at you. <laughs> so. Uh... Go here and then thirty feet. I guess I'll go here and I'll attack him. Yeah, mm -hmm. in melee. If if I kill him, hopefully. Uh, what's the melee attack? Uh, with a javelin. Count it as a melee weapon. All right. And. Click on javelin, right? Yep. Plus one damage. Oh, actually, no, because I didn't throw it. It's just five. And as a bonus action, I'll bite him. <laughs> that's definitely a hit. So that's ten damage. Yeah. You've not killed him. Well, you've severely wounded him. <laughs> well, you, like, then I'll add. Uh... 
Well, what's his HP at right now? It's very low. Do you not see his uh, cell? I will not use an action surge on that. <laughs> All right. Because he is bleeding out. He is terrified. He is bleeding out. He also pisses himself. Oof. All right, Gildred. Oh yeah, and uh, from uh, what the fuck he is it called? How do I Dang. how do I paste this into the the Grim Feast? Grim Feast. You know. Um, Me. Okay, never mind. Pretty sure you healed. I could heal. Ah, uh, yeah, ha hungry jaws. As a bonus action, you can make a special attack with your bite. If the attack hits, it deals its normal damage, and you gain temporary hit points. All right, Minimum of one, those. equal to your Constitution modifier. You can gain that, but in future, remember to tell me that at the beginning of the turn. But that's fine. What? Yeah. That's your turn. So that's my Con modifier, yeah. So it's yeah. six temporary HP. Back. Yep. It's your turn. I'd like to cast Shatter on the point specified. Uh, yeah. Oh, that one? Hold on. <laughs> one moment. That's unfortunate for them. <laughs> Bundled up next to a mage. Damn shame. <laughs> what a horrible way to die. <laughs> Uh, roll damage, by the way, on your shatter. Yeah, Dude, these guys gonna automatically die. <laughs> 3d8 <laughs> like, thunder damage. They, they're only on three roots, so they're dead. Hopefully. 20. 20. That's near max. Damn. Let me let me just adjust this a little bit, because uh, more of these guys are just instantly killed as well. I think you single-handedly are just killing more people than, than, than three of the finest regiments of the Imperial Army. You hurt my friend! You must fucking perish! <laughs> Alright. Damn, bro. You kill them! Not for the nice. bad. I like to walk 30 feet down. Yep. Hello! <laughs> He'll tip his hat at you, smile and say, D Fancy some I want to help my friends. <laughs> Will you help my friend? Yeah, he's asking, are you coming with him? <laughs> uh, I'm good. <laughs> I think right. my friends are dying. Come on, Hold on. we'll have some Telepath fun with that. All right. Telepathically connects over to Camorian. Are you dying? <laughs> uh... Give me a minute. They're not dying, but they're getting hurt. I'd like to help them. <laughs> oh, right. from my perspective, it almost says This cobalt is gonna chuck his knife at this man. <laughs> and he nailed him. Nice. He's dead. <laughs> nice. And he rushes over to you and he's like, Come on, let's get him! <laughs> he pulls his knife out, starts waving it around. Nice. <laughs> this other boy stabs this man for five. Like fucking Batman with a battering throwing a throwing knife into somebody's neck. Fantastic brutality. Yeah. This <laughs> man is gonna stab this one. For three. I, I, I fucking love these Cobalt Commandos. <laughs> Commando! <laughs> I'll just start screaming. <laughs> All right. Come uh, on, though. Hang on, where is the uh, the actual? Thing? The boys all kind of continue pushing back and forth. More of the uh, the elves start entering the fray. Oh shit! There's another <laughs> regiment of elves. Yeah. <laughs> Or company, rather. Yep. Alright. Elijah. Yes, sir. Pardon. It's your turn. I'm gonna head out of the woods. Yes, sir. Well, 
Let's head over. Over to the fella. And yep. we'll get it like that. Well, I thank you for your great. Just off. I'm up. You know, I he'll walk all the way over to. Him. Are you getting on? Uh, so I let you mount as a free action because uh, they're gonna keep riding on your other turn. Nice. All right. So, Captain, you see your friend get on the enemy. <laughs> well, best of luck out there in the field. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Telepathically speaks in your mind. Are you sure about this? See when it's over. Okay. I mean, he seems sincere. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Is, that, is that you then, Pasta? Yeah. That, right. That's Elijah for you. All right. The boys are gonna. Uh, and uh, they're gonna keep riding. It seems like you're sincere. So I keep hey, wait, accidentally not? taking. Uh, thing with me every time I move. Let me just move these guys about 50 feet and then uh, there you go. <laughs> so Stu, as you stand there like fighting away in the battle, you look over <laughs> and you see past on the back of yeah. the war. Oh, <laughs> riding Actually, towards I... the enemy camp. <laughs> can I say one last thing to Pasta as he rides away? Yeah. Yeah, go on. All right. Try to get the commander outside. Hit me. That's why I said try to get the commander outside. Are you gonna you use the tele telepathy for that, or? Yeah, yeah, I'm using telepathy for that. Okay, go. Cool. All right. Understood. Yeah. I will handle the rest. <laughs> All right. Just make sure you get close enough. The spider. Yes. Spoder. I actually walked down further, so I'm gonna make uh, oh, saves range. for those other other wargs. Oh, no, don't to disregard to that. Get this shit together. Wrong one. There it is. Sixty feet. God damn it! One of the wargs is still terrified. Uh, uh, actually, yeah. If it's if it's still terrified, then the beast will be. Oh, we're using proxy. Love it. All right, that's the case. What's that? Six psychic damage. <laughs> to who? If it's still being affected. Oh, that one? Yes. Just to, just assume if there's any wargs that are being affected by that six psychic damage. Okay. And it's within range, I guess. I could just move it now. Oh, I can't move it. I don't have I don't have permission. Oh, you don't? Oh, I thought you did. No. No. Brilliant. I'll just put it here. Six damage <laughs> he gets in the way as these guys wait to try and <laughs> let him catch up. <laughs> I'm coming for you! Did they shout him, get over yourself so you fall back. Alright. I haven't, I haven't moved the spider yet, right? Oh, uh, it's still 60 feet. I could move it 40 feet that way. Alright. Just uh, still be in communicate. Actually, 20 feet. Just keep stealth. All right. How's it going over here? I will speak to. Let's see. Stealth. Stealth. It is proceeding. Though those wham balls are rather troublesome. <laughs> I'm trying to catch up. <laughs> no worries. Stay All right. Safe. That, will end, that will end Spoder's turn. Preserving stealth. Is that your turn? Yes. Elise, it is your turn. All right. You see past um, to right past on the on the work. Yeah. Stay on the other side. <laughs> Bye. <All right>. <laughs> uh, Bye, Felicia. <laughs> hmm. I'm still channeling searing smite. Uh, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll just sword the guy. Oh, that guy's terrified. Yeah. Yep. Ward. 
the uh, go ahead. Right hand. Hey, okay. these guys are just wearing like like heavy wool jackets. So. <laughs> Fucks. Dude, searing blade is really nice. What the hell? So is that nine plus six? Yes, yeah, a fifty damage to him and six. So that's fire. <laughs> Uh, this Bro. man also catches fire and uh... Oh. <laughs> you know what, I'm gonna roll uh... Oh. Off the top of your head, what the um... Uh, only war rules for random direction stuff, do you remember what it is? It's, D8, it's like a D8 or D10. Let's do that, as, as like one of his, his shot pouch kicks off. Which direction yeah. is seven? Is that towards you? It's like around there. Oh, up that way. Okay, so up it goes off. Clockwise. And just blast this gun. Because he usually yeah, goes in a clockwise fashion. It uh, yeah. blasts this gun over here for uh, two damage. Bro. Okay. I probably shouldn't waste <laughs> two cans of Bug Club. Just <laughs> his friend. Yep. Okay. Trapnel was the method of the day. Mm -hmm. All right. Is that that's you then? Yeah, that's my round. So. I would I would have I was tempted to use the frag grenade rules, but then I realized how good they were. They're so really I didn't good want in D and D. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't want to just kill you off. Uh, Captain, it is your turn. Camorian will hold the line. <laughs> Strategy and boat. Hold the line. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Command and Conquer General's reference for today. As he will continue to hit this werebore with the spiritual weapon. Go ahead. Dealing 10 points of damage. Yeah, that's good. And he is gonna continue. He is gonna continue to try and wail on the uh, werebore okay. with his uh, mace. Magic mace. Dealing. That's a hit. Six point. That's six points of damage. Nice. Okay. And he will, oh, oh he would yeah. just invoke, he would just invoke his emperor saying, guide my mace and give it purpose. Smash these fuckers into the dirt. You hear a shout from across the battlefield, he's like, yes, I hear you! <laughs> keep, keep, keep doing that! Whatever it is you're doing, keep doing it! <laughs> Why is there like 60 men over there and you still haven't killed like 14? Have you not seen how much cannon is firing on us? Get your ass to work, you. <laughs> Send You're to, talking uh... to the God Emperor. <laughs> All right. Uh, help those who help turn, themselves. Right? <laughs> help those who uh, help themselves. <laughs> are the wargs on our side? These guys, so they're not, right? No. All right. Let's see. As you can see from your position, they've taken the captive. He looks. He looks familiar. <laughs> Oh, Asa well. has been spirited away. Uh, let's see. Anime was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I think my javelin's uh, range was 60. If I move up... Uh, what's the... Okay, so 40... Alright, so... Checks out. I will throw a javelin through the... Using, uh, like, a skill that I have. Let's see. I will put, paste it into the, uh, the thing. 
the chat. No, no, not this one, this one. Piercing arrow. I will paste it in here. So I will throw this javelin in a kind of like from where I am in a straight line. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, let's see. I don't have to make an attack roll. Instead, the arrow flies forward in a line that is one foot wide and 30 feet long. Before disappearing, the arrow passes harmlessly through objects, ignoring cover. Each creature in that line must make the dex 30 saving throw. On a failed save, the target takes damage as if it were hit by the arrow, plus an extra 1d6. So, uh, well, from where I am, in a straight line. Well, so I assume it's the... right through these three mounted people who are in a perfect yes, straight exactly. line. Yes, exactly. There you exactly. go. <laughs> and then that's six potential hits, I see. Alright, Dex. So it would be... Yeah, but I don't know why, uh, what save they have to, like, what they have to Dex. hit to succeed. It would be your spell casting modifier plus your uh, proficiency. Eight. Eight plus that. So, what's your spell casting modifier? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Let me open up your sheet and have a look. Uh, what, what class is he again? Uh, Arcane he Archer. Fighter. Arcane Archer Fighter. Except we replaced the word archer with peltist, so he's a javelin archer. Yeah. Uh, oh, what's happening? I, I, I'm hijacking your sheet a second while I try and figure out uh, your thing. What's it called? Piercing arrow? Uh, yes. It's an arcane shot option. Arcane shot. Uh, just make a javelin attack, I guess. And, uh, you might give me some intro, because I don't see it on your sheet, actually. Uh, just you know what, that's a crit. <laughs> So I gotta, I gotta allow that to do double damage. Plus, I mean, uh, it deals uh, it does from the other thing on those who fail. A save that, Let's and it save. does an additional what? What's your strength? A one d six piercing damage, an additional one d six. What's your strength? Stop. I'd say anyone uh, that's lower than 15 gets hit. Okay, that's all but one. Uh, so, all but one. You rolled a four. No, that's. Uh, you rolled something? I rolled back, so. Um, so, you're eight plus five plus four equals 17 damage to all but. All but. All but this warg has been hit for 17 damage. Though he takes half if he made the save. Half. Okay. I'll, I'll show you that in a second. So, uh, Neko. Yeah? Three of these guys just fall off. Oh shit, I was gonna use ac Action Surge and do it again. Ah, <laughs> oh, the wargs are still alive. Hang on, I got that far. You have to do it all one by all one right. second. <laughs> Uh, 17 versus that. Oh, I found it. If an option requires a saving throw, your arcane shot save equals 8 plus your proficiency bonus plus your int modifier. 
That's in the arcane shot options. Oh, okay, oh, intelligence shit. is plus two. What's my proficiency bonus? Two. That'd be a twelve. This fucking field. You're taking us um. out. Fuck. <laughs> you <laughs> you shot probably... past his escort. <laughs> I should probably write that somewhere, so you said uh, it's uh... Just, just write it out somewhere in your notes, and uh, we'll worry yeah. about it later. For I'll now, write it in the arcane for... archer thing, so you said yeah. uh... 8 it's... plus proficiency plus int. Modify. For now, you've unhorsed several people. Uh, I don't think I'm ending up with the medics now, I think I'm ending up in prison. So, my proficiency is 2, you said, right? Yes. If you're and my intelligent mod, mod is too... Actually, hold on. Let me let me just look that up to be sure. Fighters are a bit of a weird. Yep. No, your proficiency is still too. All right. Okay, so it's twelve in total. Yeah. When you're fifth level, it will be thirteen. Okay. All right. Is that your turn? Then? So, no, no, no. I'll use action surge and do the same thing. Yeah. But, uh, in this direction, uh, where's the ruler? Oh, that line. Okay. Are you 100% And trying to avoid Elijah, yeah? Um, technically you won't be able to. I won't be able to? Yeah. Hmm. You won't be able to avoid him. You're trying to what now? Oh, like the heavens. Because he is mounted on the on the mount you're trying to hit. So. Well, as the lizard man, do I really care? Yeah, I'm right next to him. They're trying to take me to a medic. As far Are as you're concerned, he's the he's the tank. God damn. Okay, so to me, Bro. it looks like he's defecting, right? Maybe. Can I can I make a reaction? <laughs> I would like to telepathically well, talk to Sentry. I can't miss him technically because I can do it here or here. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Do it. Yeah, do so it. I'll shoot them in this direction, yeah? Go on. Wait, and save. I'm gonna do the same thing, oh, right? Shit. So they need to make a save. Mm -hmm. Or else, uh, I don't. Yeah. Wow, they all saved, but they take half of this Hang damage. Hang on, you're slide. getting ahead of yourself, because there's two more. Right. Yep. And then, uh, this uh, is there's, um, where is the lieutenant? Okay, and what was the okay. save against? Uh, against 12. 12, right. okay, yeah, anyone above 12. Is, right. And they take, uh, if they save, they take half of uh, nine damage, or so I don't know which is it up or down. I think it's usually rounded down. All right. So nine or four. This motherfucker is a flying pike block. What the fuck? As you're sitting there past the. Save what's coming around for us. <laughs> A magical javelin just flies through all of your boys. <laughs> uh, the lieutenant takes. Uh, you said half damage, so that's half of seven. Yeah. Half of nine is four. Well, so three four. damage. Oh, he has resistance. I'm terribly sorry about thank, that. Thank, thank fuck. Did not expect that. What? Wait, are these guys on our side? Does it matter at this point? <laughs> I guess not. You will no, hear your knows. mind telepathically. Do not fire. Do not fire. He is being taken for medical attention. You are violating the Geneva Convention. <laughs> what is the good Geneva suggestion? It doesn't exist. There here, is no Geneva just... Convention. I know, but this is just this is just being a meme. That last one was a meme. The rest of that is said though. All right, but then I didn't but, do my movement you... action, and I'm but... just gonna move next to this guy. 
bombs. <laughs> then that's my turn. Whoa. The lizard mentality kicked in. All right. You have proof. Yep. So that's your turn. Yes. But All right. A barbarian. Uh, All Warwick, right. It is your turn. Being, being that the, the fighting should eventually turn in their favor, I will be going down south. Yeah. What's going on in this neck of the woods? Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, is that yeah. your turn? Nope. I would oh. like to cast my Frostbite cantrip at Boar Man over here. Go ahead. Ooh. I still have one hand axe. This one it is within 60 feet. You can recover your old ones. <laughs> Just yeah, to... but uh, it's in the middle of the fray. <laughs> this is one Native American who doesn't like to recycle. Well, I, Wait, I'm not gonna go in the middle of the fucking battle to retrieve my shit, right? That's <laughs> what I have on me. All right. Hold on. What's that do, Warman? What? Why is that coming out at twelve? Huh. It well, should you, be 14. It should be. Well, ignore it for now. We'll just say it's 14. Yeah. All right. All right. So who's, who's that will be? Save? What, are we, what are we doing? Uh, this poor man attacking Camorian. All right. It will be 1d6 cold damage, and if he succeeds, it will not be taken. Uh, the werebore is going to do a con save. 12. It fails. Doesn't succeed. Yep. Roll damage. Four damage. I am assisting. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> All right. That should end my turn. Actually, eh, no, end my turn. I'm saving those spell slots. I need them. Yep. Is that your turn? Yep. That end my turn. All right. So the elves are gonna move in. Fire a volley at the uh, the boys retreating. Can't catch a brick. Yeah. This is like no. This is almost like next to no range for musket fire. I don't think I'm gonna make it. I don't think I'll make it to the. Two hits. Uh... Medic. This is a Jack Sparrow moment, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this is a real fucking Jack Sparrow moment. Two of the wards are shot dead. Alright. Hey, I, I, if he's not gonna make it, we're, we're gonna have to split oh, 1,000 you, know, you know what also just hit? <laughs> you know what just hit pasta? The, the, the artillery barrage? Maybe. The, the fellas right behind us? Cannon just hit you. Hit you. Right. Ah, fucking cannon! Oh Ooh, boy. Did I say it was 5 or 8d10s? I can't remember. Ah, 8d10. 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 Boy. Okay. I'm gonna. Uh, let's do six, Head out for the medic, eight. and before you fucking know it, I've lost my leg and lost my brain. <laughs> you could survive this. There's a reason why Napoleonic War veterans were highly damage. As it just. Oh. I got. Where's the. Rim that might trip. That's a You can damage. take 40 this damage. This cannon or goes die. right through. It takes. Yeah. Okay. 48 damage to those two guys. Oh, that this line. is not my part of it. So the guy that Simbu just hit from the side just gets hit from the rear. 48 Mine. damage. They're there, not only unhorsed and uh, killed, they're instantly fucking vaporized. <laughs> they're they instantly uh, min oh. minced meat. The situation has escalated. <laughs> I have a question. What's the standard size poundage for a field artillery? That thing just says 8d10. I don't know. <laughs> okay. A lot. There you go. 
I was thinking maybe like what, a 16 pounder or something? I, I don't know. Um, oh, also, I, I keep forgetting. Uh, shit. Slash roll. 1d6. I did not roll that correctly. Damn it. Two psychic damage on the warg. That is still being affected Always by the fantastic people dying force. around me. <laughs> So, as we have hit the three hour mark, <laughs> I will say this is the last round of combat. No, no boy. And then we'll be leaving it to pick up next week because this is taking a while. Yeah, yeah. maybe. Right. There's a lot of enemies. I down with the, some last combat. I was hoping to avoid that, but. Okay, Elijah, go ahead. What are you doing? I'm g uh, I... You can delay your turn until the, the warg arrives. So I'm gonna send him. A... Uh, before I do that, I'm gonna send a message to Senmu, by way of my cantrip, and I basically say, uh, while I can't have. What? Officially you say that I sanctioned that action. Though for my own safety Halfway and otherwise, the message you cut out well, I can't uh, officially say I sanctioned that action. Because it's a loud bang <laughs> as it shatters one of the war skulls. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> my bad, I looked it up. It's like a 12 pounder. Dear heavens, chaos! Uh, yeah. Right. I appreciate the chaos and the brutal efficiency. Wait, was I not supposed to do that? I, you appreci have to I appreciate the chaos. And the brutal efficiency. Actually, you know what? Is that your turn, Pasta? Is that your turn, Pasta? Pasta? Yep. Is that uh, your turn? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Take that, yes, yes, yes. And maybe like a bonus action. Pasta. Nice. Arrived at the line. I will ask everyone if they would like to leave it here or continue doing one more round. Appreciate the ride, boys. That was eventful. Would you like to leave it here for now or would you like to uh, do one more round? I think it's. I think we should end it to the end of the round because then Bill would show up and his initiative could be added. Alright. Cool. That would be convenient. Alright, we'll do that then. Alright, so pasta. You arrive yes, at the line at uh, Mr. Uh, Mon Lieutenant Mundruk shouts at uh, another lieutenant over here who is uh, who says uh, take him for medical I, was, I, need, I need to deal with my old boys and he dismounts and starts petting his war who's panicking I, I still don't understand why is the enemy taking him for medical yeah pasta this man is uh wishing to bring you somewhere. I don't know whose I'll face that him. is, but that's someone's face. Uh, 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 <laughs> Exhibit. He's so happy, look at that man. <laughs> I almost want to say Steve Harvey looking ass. <laughs> Yo, dog! I heard you like spamming chat with fucking Napoleonic War music. <laughs> All right, Basta. Would you like to uh, go with the bad to get some medical care? Hi. All right. I will be going with the man. You can use your movement to uh, head towards 
a tent. <laughs> yeah. I suppose I'll uh, head towards the medical tent. Yeah. All right. Then. Yeah, just head in there. Yeah, just lay myself down on the bed. Mr. Exhibit will uh, assist you from his. Uh... So, uh, anyway. Could. Uh, yes. okay. Who's in charge here? Eh? Oh, no general. offense, I mean. Just out of curiosity. Oh, the general. He's over there at the big tent. What's he doing at a time like this? Generally? Yes. There's lots of busy work. Doing general things? Yep. And there's a lot of general work. <laughs> you know what, Pasta? Make a perception test to see if you can see out like a gap in the tent and see the general. Oh shit, 20. Pasta. Oh, yeah, let me, let oh me, no, let me he just, sees uh, general chat. Let me, let me just move this into the GM. <laughs> As you can see over here, the general... General Will, okay. over here eating some cheese and, and drinking some uh, nice okay. Spanish wine. In his uh, general catching tent. some rays. No, he's uh, he's reading a book. <laughs> How to run D and D. He's uh he's uh doing some general things over there in his tent while eating some cheese. If I hadn't used my message, I'd be fucking messaging him. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'd really fuck with him actually. <laughs> Mental go. pinging. <laughs> General Will is uh, on, on the case. He's, he's gonna defeat the, the God Emperor. <laughs> anyway, uh, is that your turn then? Um, Warbeck, spider time. That would be me, yes. Well, uh, technically it's them. Mm -hmm. Spider time. Spood! Yeah, <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna do a, a, a save for that fucking war and see if I can get out of that situation. Yes. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> they, there's, like, these two guys over here are like, fucking get over yourself, there's nothing there! <laughs> the thing was, I, I feel like if you actually did roll the war game no! for all those, it would have. Imagine Damn. if I threw a javelin through all these guys. <laughs> Alright. Still, you can do that. Uh, no, I'm out of, uh, yeah, arcade right. shots. More bank. Yep, I'm, I'm legging it. Mm -hmm. Go for it. That you should gotta, be a hundred You gotta pick feet. up your spider. Uh, well, actually, the spider is the other thing. Um, yeah. That's your turn, then? Yeah. El Delice. Alright. Uh, let's see. The wargs just got fucking butchered as they crossed the open ground. <laughs> Ooh, very good. Very good. Compliments to gunnery. All right. <laughs> Just give the dogs a thumbs up. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I'll I'll just finish it. I'm off. Um. Let's let's charge it. My boy. No. <laughs> just fuck me. Yeah. All right. I need to drink more water to yeah. <laughs> regain stuff. To get, to get your stamina back, I see. Yeah. Alright, if that's you then, uh, it's over yeah, to, uh, to Captain. It is your turn. Morian says he's still fighting two fucking giant wo <laughs> werebores. <laughs> Sticking out. Sticking out me weapon for. He did kind of get left behind. <laughs> where, <laughs> where is there? Yeah, I don't know why. That's why I'm coming to help. Yeah. Sticking out to me, Gat. Sticking out your Gat for Camorian. <laughs> it hits the nay nay. <laughs> As I use my uh, spiritual weapon, hit this guy for eight more damage. Mm -hmm. With my mace. Yep. Oh, that's what that symbol is. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's a rock. It's a rock in a sock on a stick. It's it's a traveling bag. 
It's a cloth flail. Yeah. <laughs> it's a rocky nasaka. <laughs> Alright. That's a hit, Captain, for 8 damage on the other guy. Alright. Simbu. Yes. It is your turn. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of far away, yeah. Yeah, I guess the only this guy is alive in here, right? Oh, there's actually a guy next to me, never mind. Yeah, he's like right there. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, do a hand axe, right? But I'm gonna use the javelin thing again. It's yeah. the same dice. You split his skull. Okay, and I'm gonna bite him as well. Go ahead. As a bonus action. Mm -hmm. ah. Yep. I guess that misses. Huh? Does I it... believe it would. Okay. Yeah. He, so uh, that that's just five pure five well, slashing, I guess. Yeah. Who did we? Uh, there you go. That's uh, my turn. Okay, Womack. Yellow. It's your turn. Hmm. Shit. Alright. Uh. I think it's just gonna be moving. Another 30 feet and shooting another frostbite at this pig bastard. That is my core, not my spellbook. Thank you. Spell save PC 14. Against two? Against the uh, pig currently fighting Kamori. Okay. The pig bastard. Yeah, I just need you to specify which one specifically. Yep, yep. Um, it's Khan, isn't it? Uh, damn. Yes. Damn, that sucks. Damn. Does he resist <laughs> or does he take half damage? He take. He resists. Okay. He doesn't say anything about taking half. Got used to the cold. I see. Son of a bitch. Is that your turn? Uh. Is it possible if I could cast Mold Earth to his north to prevent him from chasing me? Actually, no, I can't. That's that's casting two cantrips. No. Nope. Okay. Good. That's, that's your turn. Yep, that's my turn. All right. So the kobolds are gonna continue stabbing. Actually, I am going. I'm going to do one thing. Also, okay. 1d6 psychic damage. That's one damage to the warg that's still affected. And... Going to... Telepathically speak to... Sylph? Is it Sylph? Sylph. The, uh, Komorian needs help. We still have the werewolves behind us. Roger that. On our way. <laughs> that should be my turn. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Kobolds get all stabby over here in, in the forest. Uh, one of them missed, but the other two hit. Um. The elves here advance. The pillar keeps. Anytime anyone walks near the pillar, they keeps coming with them. Bro. The guys level their <laughs> their weapons <laughs> at the boards, <laughs> and they fire a volley, two on each. One, two. One, two. I believe Damn. that is two hits. One, I'll just put one on each. So, what is it? A D12? One, two. So that's five plus two. Seven plus two. Is nine. 
9 damage to 1. I'll put 9 on this one with the gate of the captain. And then I'll put That. Of the we initiative. will uh, leave, leave it here, I guess, with the baffle for now. <laughs> part one. Yep. Yeah. I guess part, uh, part, part one as we uh, are three hours and fifteen minutes. <laughs> there you go. It uh, was the, a lot the of battle action. To we end had all to battles. Go yeah, then, uh, the, the battle to end all. It ended up being a lot more combat than it Battles. intended there, but okay. Part <laughs> two. Part three. Yeah. A lot of a lot of cannons need to hit stuff more uh, often. Well, when one hit, it fucking minced to, to, like, to like four people, so... You know? Actually, was, mm -hmm. there, was it three or four? I can't remember. Yeah, it was quite a, quite a few. I right. gotta say, though, that was fucking chaotic. I love it. May have wasted too many spells on the front lines. I don't know. I think you really helped there actually push the the odds in their favor on the single bad damage. Yeah. I tried. I really did. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> yeah. So. I threw a ten foot chupacabra at a motherfucker. Any uh, <laughs> uh, final messages? But the real question. My Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Subscribe to Next Patreon. <laughs> Sorry. Go on. Also, uh, give a shout out to our boy. Uh... Do you want to give him a shout? I don't out have a go? Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Give a shout out to our boy Shiro. Give him, uh, give him, uh, give him some, mm. kids, some, some. If you want some nice art? Give him a shout. Yeah. He, uh, uh, our boy Shiro. I'll put a link to his. Uh, his Twitter in the description of the video, if you want some uh, some nice art. Quotations. What about chaos? Will you? I don't know. Maybe you should uh, ask him. Maybe can Kill chaos. Chaotic, nah, maybe not. Chaotic art. Yeah. Fair. See everyone next week. Yeah. yeah. With the part two electric boogaloo of the Napoleonic. Another <laughs> chaotic time. <laughs> Big fight. And um, another chaotic channel. Yeah. <laughs> all right then. I guess we shall uh, see you all next time. Same bad time, same bad channel. Bye. Dragon Ball Z. Bye. -bye. Bye.